Hey, what up, everybody? Uh, I'm just doing some things in the background. Welcome to the audio video test for Skull Grows. Get great this Saturday. Oh, man, it's been a bit... Uh, we'll, we'll be starting shortly in about, you know, 19 minutes. Let me just get the second matchups uh, together, and then we'll do some things on stream. Let's try to match people up real quick. I've got some food with me. We're going to be chilling today. It'll be nice. Yeah. I need to kill one of his things.
Let's see. Nice. So, third thing to. Here. Got everybody matched up. Oh, there's some people who said they weren't being here. So, quick. Uh, mace traps can't be here. Hey. King W. Okay. Up yours out. And so this leaves this still even, so that's okay. And let's see who's got a question. the things let me post this in the thing real quick thank y'all apologies nothing really happening on, on screen
Bitcoin. Matchups have been posted. Dark save. Up, up, up. Open up. Oop. Look at story, story mode is whack. Why, why can't she fireball? What? What? <laughs> what is this? Greatness? True. And confirm. Um, I'm gonna open up a different web browser. 10 minutes. Hopefully, everybody's here. Let's see. Me tonight. Otherwise, we're just gonna have me. <laughs> Was real. She exists. Back to right here. People in that can <laughs> get great chat. Wow. All right, buddy. Welcome. We'll start in about ten minutes. Hopefully, I sound okay. I had to get a new interface because my old one died, and uh, quite badly, it died. <laughs> uh, couldn't hear anything out of my headphones, and the microphone was kind of a. Uh, Getting busted. Ooh, thanks. I'll appreciate it. Forever clone. Like you said. <laughs> Welcome. Welcome. Doug. Oh, that's the wrong. Ugh, how does it do this? What is it? That? Doug Tufilia. Hey, there it is. That's the one. Oh, it's a skull G Tufilia. That's what it is. I should have changed it to Skug. That's all fun. That one. Nasty. Alrighty. Let's, uh, let me see. Let me hop into. Oh, we need to be on beta. Oh, God. My mistake. Beta. First off. There we go. <laughs> Doing this on beta now until Umbrella gets released someday. Let's play a match or two. Let's see. I'd like to get in here, play a few games. Will we start the Dangle tournament? Tournament? <laughs> the Dangle event. Then here we can play a little bit. If you would like. Starting in about nine minutes. It'll be good. Ah, and that's spectator. Okay. <laughs> That's a typo. Yeah, it's a typo. Hold on. Oh, I forgot to um, do the three. It's a typo. Three flood maps. There's a lot of people today. Is this the way to learn, Skullgirls? True! If we'd like to learn Skullgirls, our place is the way to do it. Let's 
Oh, for the mercy. Oh, man. People's elbow. Uh -oh. oh, rip. Mm. Hey. Oh, God, with the raw tech. The diamond drop. Oof. Schmixy. More Schmixy. I know I joined. There's a lobby link that was in the Twitch chat. If you want to join the lobby for a little bit, we'll be starting in about five minutes. But here's the lobby link if you want to join and play some games. We choose violence. Shoot him. Oh, what a shot, dude. No confirm, though. Yeah, crack up on a cold one for the boys and girls. Hey. Tongue twister reset. Reflector. Ooh, schmixy. Oh, schmixy. Oh, you're dead, dude. Wow. Grippy. Oh my gosh, she autocorrected. She's blind. Hey. Oh, that's plus. Oh no, rip! But oh, she dodged the thing! <laughs> oh, but but you didn't block. Rip. And the <laughs> And the bubbles cause combo. That's crazy. That is a wild friend. God, 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 boosh. Retina reflector. do this match and then start the stream everybody mind your marks uh -oh.
Thank you for a ride. Ba, 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 ba. Hey. Big fan, happy birthday, Kappa. <laughs> Philly is cooler, I just heard that. Bam, bam, bam. Hello, we're down back. Fortunate. Oof. GG's. We got one minute, so. <laughs> it's it's kind of rude to one and done, but you know. <laughs> gotta get this thing. Gotta get the shebang going to let me make a new lobby. Lots. In case people want to be here. Well, hopefully this doesn't break. Starting in a minute. Let me make sure of things real quick. There. Ba, 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 ba. Or, or, oof. uh, God, thing, where's the thing? This hard to tell, towards a small thing. Do, 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 cart. Oh, rip. There you go. And extra. Cool beans. 7 p.m. Welcome, everybody. Officially, the Skull Girls get great. Come here to get some advice on your play. We try to match you up with opponents of equal skill. Kind of give you advice on where to go next, depending on what you need help with. Whether it's comma consistency, neutral, game plans. In game decision making, all those kinds of things. Currently solo, so I guess we'll see if someone decides to hop in here for a little bit. Uh, so we have one beginner match, and it's just going to be the just the one beginner match. This is not a tournament. Just, just, just so to clarify, this is not a tournament. We're playing flat matches, so it doesn't matter who wins or who loses. It'll be three flat matches this week. Um, so you get to play your three flat matches, and then we kind of give you advice on where to go next. Uh, a lot of NA players, but not a lot of EU players. Yeah. Sometimes there's a lot of... Sometimes there's like the one week where there's a bunch of EU players, and that's that's pretty alright. For the most part, we haven't really had any issues with EU players. So, you know, we try to, we try to get try to get some, some people from across the pond. Um, but should be okay this week. Uh, we only got one match for beginners this week. We got Justicar versus Team Gorilla. If you are participating in tonight's event, please, that's an E I S C O R D. Click on that link. Be, I'll be calling matches in S G G G R 8 only channel. Please, please, please. Good to have name consistency as well. Just so we don't, you know, get who's here and who's on. So if we got just a car versus Steam Gorilla. Pulls in here. Here is the lobby link. You're playing three flat matches. Steam Girl is here. And Steam Girl had told me that uh, Valve will literally not let you have Steam in your name. Because, you know, I guess it's some sort of copyright protection. <laughs> Going around using my name like that. What up, Ian? What up, random Rocky Ian? I got more packages. It is, yeah, pretty much. Yeah, it is copyright protection. I'm not surprised. Yeah, <laughs> they want to make sure. I got some new things for my Steam Deck. Gonna be a good time. HDMI cable, a docking situation, so I can actually hook up to my monitor. And then I want to start. I'm gonna try to start using it for streaming sessions to see how it's gonna play out versus my normal PC. 
That's going to be a fun time. Team deck is so good. Oh my god. I've been able to use it for work twice and it's so efficient. Like, oh man. Ah, uh, just being able to carry a PC with you in such a small form factor and have it be supremely reliable is such a godsend. Like, well, ah. Uh. Of course, it still got to. I'm sure they've got like a wide variety of filters <laughs> to get you. Like, you know. <laughs> I wouldn't be surprised. So just a car seems to be offline. That's going to be quite difficult. Let's see. No steam allowing steam. Not at all. If it's, if it's in your name, they're going to be like, nah, it's our name today, sir. What, what all did I get? I have a dock. I've got a stand. Um, I got a 15.5 inch monitor touchscreen sort of thing for the dealio. Uh, so that should be good for the mobile, the, the heckin' whatchamacallit, the, the setup that I want to do for Combo Breaker. That's gonna be. I am going to Combo Breaker as well. That's gonna be good times. I just need to get my plane ticket. Because uh, me and five other people in one room, uh, and I'm paying for the room. That's gonna be a fun time. It'll be great. Combo breaker will be fun. All right, so let's see. It seems like our person's not here. So we're going to make this an open lobby. So what happens when someone's not here is that we turn it into an open lobby. Uh, yes, it's definitely not letting you join. Yeah, that makes sense because we just started. So it is not your turn just yet. Um, so we're in the beginners part. So if there is a beginner player, we usually say between zero and about 80 to 100 hours that will play against Steam Gorilla. Please join this dangled lobby. Not you, Fervent, because you're not a beginner. So <laughs> Twitch chat gets first come, first serve. Twitch chat. We take it to Twitch and then we take it to Discord. So if you are a beginner of zero to 100 hours, join this dangled lobby to play against Gorilla. Would be cool. <laughs> See, to fight big, of course. <laughs> <laughs> what if you never played an online game in, game in here? Get in here. We can teach you. We can certainly teach you. <laughs> you never played before? We can absolutely teach you. <laughs> you know, your stick right now? Rip. Uh, play on your keyboard, because that's also possible. <laughs> Try out the hitbox layout. <laughs> Advice is usually at, during or after the matches themselves. We normally tell you to not watch the stream just so you have, you know, consistent connection and that, you know, stream isn't hogging any of the bandwidth. So definitely try not to, to listen as you play to, so you don't distract yourself. Let's see here. Dog is there, but not here. Understandable. Okay. So, seems like... Things. Let me, let me hop into voice chat real quick here for a second. Doc. Oh, what's up, Jacob? Doc. I'm like... Yeah, JP in here? I need you. Oh, you need you need co commentary. Oh my uh, god, mostly for this this current thing right now. <laughs> okay, well uh, one one second, I'm I'm, I'm uh, shredding really oh, all this right now. So let me get shredding oh, people oh, right oh, now. Oh, okay. Okay. Wow, you gotta do your job, bro. What? Let me no. <laughs> <laughs> Go back, <laughs> you coward. All right, I'll, I'll be over Come in a second. Me, you <laughs> Yo, JP, let me co commentate. I'll be in there. <laughs> Oh, Go do no. your job. Go do my new job. Like, wow. Alrighty, what's going on, JP? Man, how's it going? Oh, hold on. We're gonna we're gonna do something. We're gonna do something fairly unprecedented. Hold on. I'm excited. I'm looking forward to this. I am full of positivity. Surely this will not blow up in my face. Welcome. Oh. Oh. Hello. How are you? <laughs> Adequate. 
You are on stream, so be careful. Oh, awesome. Hey, so, hi, everybody. I, I, I know you make it a habit of introducing yourself by reading out your social security and full real name <laughs> and street address, uh, but just hold off on that for the time being. <laughs> 8675309. Uh, oh, dude, same here. 555-8675. Madness. So this man needs a uh, this man needs a beginner. So, uh, oh, do you want to do the, the beginner test? The beginner test. The yes, beginner yes, yes. Test. I am ready to do the beginner test. Okay. Let me also join the. Is line. he listening? There we go. Like right now, I need to get stream up. Up. I don't see chat. <laughs> 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 let me let me get this in front of me. Okay. All right. So I will I will say to any new viewers we have at home because we've kind of crapped on recently. Uh, of new people the beginner test looks like bullying it's not bullying <laughs> it's just the beginner test <laughs> so please please don't think too harshly of me <laughs> it's fine Wait, no, are you being tested for beginner doc uh, yes that is that is yes. true <laughs> i am i am a beginner i i'm like i'm like hydra i'm a retired i have beginner. signed up for beginner <laughs> The beginner test. The beginner test usually is just like doing JHP to see how they deal with it, or if they got yeah. any things to deal with it. Yeah, my, my rule is if they deal with it twice, then uh, they graduate from the beginner test. Yeah. Oh, they seem to okay, that was a twice, solution. So. Okay. Yeah. An answer. If you can come up with an answer to JHP, it's it's it's, it's yeah. It, it's generally it's generally a good sign that you understand the game's defensive mechanics and just sort of like basic fighting game fundamentals. Hey, yeah. Is that, this is a bullshit good. button to deal with, especially with an assist backing it up. All right, so he's passed the beginner test with Beowulf. He seems to be struggling with Bella, which, to be fair, Bella's anti airs are not amazing. They really um, aren't. So th this is fine. Um, Situationally good. Hey. Yeah. Whoa. yeah, yeah. That's an interesting answer. That is an interesting answer. I feel like there are better answers. So, um, is this just uh, the other beginner decided to uh, drop out and we're just doing the test, or do they okay. do they specifically request me? Or <laughs> no, I <didn't>. okay. <laughs> You're just like, oh, a Beowulf duck can bully someone. <laughs> Beowulf, get in. Ella anti ears are good at calling up mid range too. Yeah, her anti ears are not. Oh, okay. So he actually has the para zoning pattern. I use this to get on Danny a lot. A lot of paras will just get stuck uh, doing the really fast fireball like that. But he he was good. I want to call something out. Yeah. He was doing the high fireball as well to catch me in my jump. So that was really good. A lot of paras don't do that. I think I also saw him throw a uh, slow fireball too there. Yeah. Slow tier. So yeah, that I've opened him up twice now with the really annoying on block Beowulf mix, which to be fair, I opened everyone up with that. So nothing to be ashamed of there, but it's important to start learning how to deal with it. I also I want to call something out. Uh, let me get a good here. tech. Yes, very good tech. Oh no! Yeah. Oh, they jumped. Good jump. Hey. Good jump. Good jump. Oh, conversion. <laughs> hey. All right, we'll do this. Oh, okay. no. So you don't have enough life for me to double show up. I'll do it in the next game. I'll do it in the next game. Oh, God. I wanted to I wanted to give you, like, a basic Beowulf mix-up because uh, I, I saw that uh, you were... When you were playing Beowulf, you kind of got hit by a basic 50-50, and since you also play Beowulf, this is just a really easy way to start setting up a flow chart for you when you're playing. So... But the short of it is, so when Beowulf does that little landing thing when he gets you in a, in a grab in the air, uh, if he does not spend hype, it's a low throw 50-50. If you hit low, you'll beat out most people's buttons, and if you hit throw, you'll beat their block. So if you're just new to the game, you just know a basic combo, that's something really easy you can do. Just, excuse me, get him in a grab stance, go for a low throw 50-50, and you can kind of build your offense from there. So I'll try and show you what I'm talking about with this. Okay, so this is low throw. So I threw you there, and I, I beat out your button that you were mashing. And um, so you saw I got a counter hit there, and I kind of got to do whatever I want. And so now I'm going to go low. And you'll see there I kind of beat you out before you are able to uh, do anything about it there. So really simple, really easy reset route you can set up for Beowulf. Uh, 
just yeah super brain dead stuff that'll just get you started and get you actually playing the game hey, hey, so, hey, hey. <laughs> for wolf shoot there wolf shoot can be a little annoying to deal with for beginners because it's a it's a command grab and those are scary because you can't block them but note and it goes like hella far too but notice that the startup time is super long it's super easy to react to and the other thing is that a lot of Beowulfs tend to do it at the end of block strings because they're trying to catch you blocking. So just when you're blocking, Beowulf doesn't have an easy way to get into a high after he gets out of his low. So just be holding up back and then if they do it, you get a full heavy counter hit punish and you're off to the races. All right, I like the anti-air there. All right, so this is more advanced uh, stuff. So when Beowulf spends Mirror or Oki and he gets that landing there, then he gets a heavy knockdown and he can do whatever he wants. That's kind of his bag. It, the more advanced Beowulf uh, reset structure is he gets hype, he gets meter, and then he just spends that to get resets or more damage on his combos and he's off to the races. I like the attempted 5HK to beat uh, Jump Heavy Punch there from uh, Gorilla. Oof. That was pretty good. It's just uh, poorly timed. Okay. Oh, I got the I got no, the full level combo. trace. <laughs> Not the full combo. You're still plenty of unnoticed there. I don't. I have long since forgotten my combo. <laughs> <laughs> I I know the first no. part of it because it's what I use for quarter carries, but I have forgotten the ending. <laughs> so yeah, uh, the impression I'm getting is that he's played fighting games before, but he's uh -huh. very new to Skull Girls. Um, mm -hmm. So I'm gonna. So for this game now, uh, you, you've proven you can deal with uh, you can deal with the newbie test for the most part. Uh, I, I'd say you're no worse than usual. Now I'm just going to be super defensive and see how you open me up. I don't think I've seen him push block. That's a bit of a concern. Yeah. True. We've we've tried like multiple different ways to try to get in on stuff, but it doesn't seem like we we push block just yet. That's kind of your easiest way to get out of pressure. Yeah. Yeah, and I'm, I'm also not seeing a whole lot of grabs, which is the way you deal with someone who's just blocking everything. And uh, as my good friend Baghdad here can tell you, uh, grabs can be especially annoying to deal with if you're not expecting them. It is not a reversal, Doc. Stop using it, it like that. You are getting mad at me for making the correct decision. He doesn't get mad at me when he's like punishing me and he's just disappointed. He only gets mad when it works on him. Because I don't expect you to do it like four times in a row after I've punished you three times. It's the no mix-up mix-up. I guess. It's the no mix-up mix-up. <laughs> I got joined. Hey, hey. Hey. Okay, so yeah, that's my other like common defensive go-to that you kind of see myself fighting uh so i will punish you if you do something unsafe uh on block uh fuck i didn't restand oh, yeah. and but uh so i will punish you if you do anything unsafe to you but i'm just gonna like play defense for this game for the most part um oh i had a point and i lost track of it <laughs> what? okay good mix up awesome. i like the cross up he knows in the, the corner side there. Swap. nice okay. rip yeah. Crouch heavy punch for Beowulf oh, is falling it's not exactly something. So yeah, my So yeah, what often happens uh in this game is that people will get too caught up in pressuring you or pressuring somebody and um they'll kind of forget that they're not just because I'm being hit by an assist or blocking an assist, their point character isn't necessarily safe. So the way I get a lot of hits really easy in this game is I just press a button as I'm falling down and they don't realize that I'm able to press a button as I'm falling down. Really easy on Beowulf and Big Band. They both have super meaty falling buttons. You get a lot of easy hits there. Uh, congrats on beating me. Uh, you trust me, a lot of beginners, they just struggle to open me up and then they do something really dumb on block and I pull them up for it. So the fact that you were able to beat me in there, great first impression. That means you kind of understand how to open up someone who's just blocking for their life uh you kind of understand how to punish people i'd say the next big step for you is practice your bnbs we always tell people this uh that's going to be the biggest return on investment thing you can do for the future and then uh start incorporating some resets you had a good reset for bella but i didn't get the impression that you had a good idea of what you wanted to do when you got hits with beowulf and parasol it just felt like you did a bnb as long as you could and then eventually you dropped it and you just had to scramble again that's not what you want to do you want to either finish your combo or you want to get set up for a reset so you can not finish your combo but still be an advantage <laughs> 
And the great thing about playing Beowulf starting out is you don't really have to worry much about resets. Uh, mm -hmm. As long as you learn your Oki Azeme and your, uh, you know, BNB, you pretty much have that handled. And then you just get to play a low throw, and if they're wrong, you kill a character. Yeah, yeah, I mean, you'll... We, we joke about it a lot, but generally that's what's attracted me to the character is I just, I'm very bad at in the moment thinking like, okay, I hit him low cross up last time. So I'll hit him high same side this time and it makes him, I'm really bad at thinking that. So the fact that Beowulf doesn't really have to worry about all the crazy, doing all the crazy resets in this game. And he has kind of a, a simple and easy to understand game plan, which you learn as combos is really appealing to me. And I, that's why I really like him just as a character. It's, it's one less thing in the mental stack to worry about. But yeah, so is it three flat games or is it five? Yes, three, because we have so many people. To... Three. Oh, he, he said, I will return. I'm in ad hell. Hold on. Okay. Oh, he probably I doesn't realize it. it's three <laughs> flat games. So. <laughs> Alrighty. Well, if you'd be so good, JP, go ahead and uh, kick him out of my lobby. And we'll get the other players in here. Get him out of here. Get him out yeah. of here. <laughs> wow. <laughs> you don't have well, to go home, but you can't great. stay here. Who joined? I always wonder, like, yeah. where the bartender expects them to go when they say the that. Like, do they think there's another bar? Another bar? bar? <laughs> <laughs> That's actually where I expect them to go. If they're already too drunk yeah, was, over a bar, <laughs> like, is there just another seedier bar that's like, yeah, we we could you come here after you're too drunk for the night? <laughs> where I live, yes. <laughs> that's yes, great. I'm sorry. Girls. You can probably tell I don't drink. I have no idea how any of that works. <laughs> Uh, in Pennsylvania, we have uh, beer distributors where you literally drive in, like in your car, and you just buy bulk al alcohol from there. It's uh, quite comical. That's amazing. amazing. One, thing I, one thing I never understood about like alcohol. Oh is man, that you have to just drive the cars here. To the bar. So is it just a... a car, or is it just a car? I th I think it's, it's like car. justice, but it ends with car. Oh, Justice so, AR. So they were originally so. without the me. opponent for the for Steam Gorilla, but uh, mm, they finally yeah, they got their showed up late. Their, they got their time zones well, mixed up. We can give him the newbie test if we feel like. We can, we can give them the newbie test as well. I mean, we do have a stacked week this week, so if you if well, it's up to you, JP, it's your time. It's three flat matches. Get them in there. All right. Get it. All right, just the, uh, the just to, let me. Get over to actually set ready. <laughs> Just a car, go ahead and ready up, <laughs> and uh, I'll give you your three flat games. Yeah, it was three games, Steam. Sorry. <laughs> I don't have chat up in front of me, so I'll be reading messages super late. Is Tustacar gonna ready? Hmm. They may not be watching the stream, they just joined in and are now waiting for Steam Gorilla. Trying to yeah. ping them on Steam and just say, hey, go ahead and ready up, you'll play old Doc there. Or not Steam, Discord. Playing against Doc, because uh, your opponent already played, so... So out of, out of curiosity, JP, I know, so, like, you've been with Gitgrade for a while, were you one of the people who founded it, or...? Um, no. Though I came in when it was pretty early. Okay. Uh, because originally, it, originally it was Get Good. Um, yeah, yeah, I, I did, I did know that. I did know that much that there used to be a thing called Get Good, and they stopped doing it for lack of interest, and then Crank took over. I, yeah. I couldn't remember. I wasn't around for this. Obviously, I learned this later. <laughs> yeah. So then, but, eventually, uh, it was him and N, uh, and then N kind of fell off. Uh, it was him and Adwins. And then Adwins kind of fell off. And then I was like, this seems cool. Let me hop in there. <laughs> Hell yeah. There's a cat girl on my screen. There's a cat oh, right. with I'm a big the man test. on Sorry. my screen. I, z I, I zoned out. We're doing the newbie test. Okay, DP. I like that. That's one good way. Did Viper just lose the jump heavy punch? What? It does that sometimes. Like, I huh? Okay, brass is another. All right, air grab's good. All right, we're, 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 he's figuring me out slowly but surely, so that, that's a good sign. I'm gonna wait till he gets one more win against this. Yeah, the, the really tricky. <laughs> Sorry, 
<laughs> it does that, especially on like shorter characters. You can't do that against big Biggest man. man. That's an interesting idea. I got, I got, I got. Hey, hey. I'll keep our one height. Boosh. Ah. You get the double bell. You didn't get the double bell. Double gong right. sound. Apologies. I'll get. I'll get the double gong next time. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So. Still dealing with the newbie test. Fortune, actually, I think she deals with uh, jump in heavy punch a little bit better than uh, Beowulf. So the newbie test, I'm not bullying you, just to car. If you're rewatching this, uh, I'm not trying to be mean. Uh, this is just, it's the test I give beginner players, and it's kind of just a, a test of how you deal with someone who's jumping in on you. So you had the right idea. Uh, anti airs, DP, and even calling assist was pretty solid. It just seemed like you were having trouble doing it consistently. Like, you got it once, and then you expected me to stop, and then I kept doing it, and you kind of panicked and forgot how to deal with it. So that that is a tricky thing to do. Um, another another critical part. Viper also definitely lost to jump heavy punch once in there, so it, that it was a little disheartening. To see. It, it happened. It happened. Yeah. It's a Sometimes it's a good it it's a good move. The other the other critical thing about the newbie test that a lot of people don't realize when I give it to them, blocking is a win. Blocking is a win for the newbie test. Like yeah. if you can block me and push block me and get me off of you, that's yeah. a win. Like nice. the, you, you're doing exactly like, what you're supposed to do. You're getting like, me off you, and then you're hitting me with a move that beats jump and heavy punch. This is perfect. So you you get to play real neutral now. <laughs> hey, hey, hey. Careful of the reckus. Reckus are actually not safe. So if you want to end, if you wanted to end with moves on block, you really don't want to go past the medium button. Because normally the medium button is either less minus. Uh, we'll talk about frame advantage later, but like it's less, less that you have to deal with if you don't go past the medium. You blocked that, bruh. <laughs> I'm a beast, Jimmy. I'm a beast. <laughs> You're impressed with the who, chicken block. Who do you I was, think you're I was so impressed with the to. chicken block. I'm just like, dude. Who do you think you're talking to? I'm a beast. <laughs> Also, if yeah. at any point I, I, I heard it from his under... doctor, he's morbidly obese, dude. Yeah, that's not that's not even a joke. I actually <laughs> oh, no, no, I don't that's, no. <laughs> that's no. not even a joke. <laughs> I'm certain you're very handsome. I no, I'm still no. handsome, but I I am obese. <laughs> like, don't get me wrong, I am a looker. I look better than you, but <laughs> I'm Ooh. still obese. You've never seen me, you <laughs> son of a bitch. I just I know that's my hey, confidence. PG12. Oh, my bad. Sorry, JP. Yeah, you, got your, you got your one B word. <laughs> you get your one B word, your one S word, and your one F word. I, got I, was, it. I was about to say, J JP must have already given up on me. I've definitely said worse. <laughs> hey, I like the parry. Hey, hey. Low parry, too, we'll do so this. you know we'll that wasn't this. just him attempting a DP or a brass. Yeah. <laughs> well, it could have been. Maybe. Also, if at any point, if anyone uh, like beginner, ah, beginner, or just some people are just kind of jumping into the stream for the first time, um, we do have a terms command. If there's anything you don't understand about like fighting game terminology and stuff, that is a good resource to have. Yeah, I was thinking about that when you we were talking about Oki yeah, okay, <laughs> earlier. Yeah, I was like, I, I knew that was one thing. I just did not understand for the life Oki Azeme me means a knockdown situation in Japanese. Yeah, Maybe. you'll learn. Japanese You'll, language is a strange one. No, it means to wake up. That's that's. I think that's why it means something along the lines of to wake up, and that's really? it's a wake up situation. You know this for a fact? No, I saw it in a Corey gaming video, what and then I are? am excellent at retaining useless trivia. <laughs> Yo, shout outs to Corey though. Dude, shout outs to Corey. I used one of his oh, videos sure, yeah. for like a thing in college, and my yeah. it like blew my teacher's mind. She was like, "Holy shit, Drew, this is so cool." <laughs> <laughs> Go for it, yeah. If, if it's something that'll help the community at large, yeah, link it up. Oh, yeah. <laughs> if you would, Baghdad, link link that awesome, like, glossary video he had. It's called White Button Mashing Doesn't Work. Ah, uh, yes, you got it. Oh, that, yeah, that video is great, actually. <laughs> video is amazing. My favorite video from him, though, is the need for community. That's a banger. Absolute banger. All right, I'm liking, I'm liking. So first of all, uh, Jester Car is winning on Team Select. These are two excellent characters. Um, 
Barass is a good assist, and you seem to be using it well. Honestly, I'd say you're being a little too conservative with it. Be a bit more egregious. Oh, I'm so in a slow situation. I don't have a good way of dealing with Barass right now, so you should just be calling it left, right, and center. It's good on offense. It's good in neutral. It's good on defense. All right, That's pushing buttons. We don't want buttons. that. So yeah, that that's one thing to know about Beowulf uh, low low high mix is that the high buttons have way more range than you think they do. Like actually, they're more of like mid range buttons than close range stuff. If anything, they take a little bit longer to reach you when you use them in the mid range. But like even from here, I can reach him from Ooh, with, this, with that. So that's something to keep in mind. Is you may think you're far enough away to be safe, but you're not really. Okay, so similar advice. Uh, we tell this to all beginners, but just practice your BNBs. Again, it, it helps you learn character movement. It helps you get damage. You have to win neutral less when you get it. That's how you kind of get to the next step of learning the meta. It's the one thing that's going to have like the biggest return on investment that you can do to improve. Um, be a little bit more egregious with HBRAS. Don't be afraid to throw it out, uh, especially at your level with the kind of people you you should be like worrying about playing. You should not be worrying about playing me or Magnat or JP. No, no, no. <laughs> the, the, the level of people you should be like playing and actually trying to win against, just call Brass over and over, and that'll like win you entire games on its own. So be a little bit more egregious. And um, don't be so afraid. Uh, there's definitely a point where you were just like, stop trying to be aggressive or uh, stop trying to like reversal me when I was jumping in. And that's not adaptation. That, there's a difference between like becoming afraid of what I'm doing and adapting to what I'm doing. And I felt like you were getting a little bit more nervous. So I, I always encourage kind of like a, a <laughs> brain small, body strong approach to this game. So <laughs> don't, stop worrying so much. Just throw out a big button and hope for the best. <laughs> At least when you're starting out, because eventually you get into yeah, the yeah, yeah, totally. version version of this game where it gets super high level. Uh, but that's yeah. like that's like ages away. So yeah, in my opinion, the 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 two big goals of a beginner should be to improve, to learn a combo, and improve your results. Not necessarily get more wins, but just like you know, this game I got a hit. This game I defended that thing that I wasn't defending before. This game, even just noticing something is helpful even if you don't know how to deal with it just noticing like huh he's hitting me overhead like 50 times in a row that's still a win so just focus on those two things if you're if you're new to this game and you're kind of frustrated with where you're at right now just focus on getting your bnb down really really good and just improve your result a little bit and just find one little win you can give yourself and be happy with that and build from there what do say? I'm sure if this was mentioned mid-match, what is a reliable anti-air for Sarabella against JHP? Uh, it's well, complicated. Bella buttons, it's complicated, yeah. It's complicated. So you did have the right idea. Assist calls against JHP are very good. Um, when you were calling uh, Bella assist call and then just blocking with Beowulf, that was working out great for you. Uh, Parasol is not the character to be... Parasol tier is not the character to be doing that with, but that's one option for you. As Bella, honestly... I was mentioning this earlier. I'm not sure if you were listening, but blocking is a win. You don't yeah. don't get addicted to getting the big hit, getting the big combo. Blocking and just sending me back to neutral is a win, especially when you have a neutral assist. Like when you're playing solo Beowulf and you have tier assist, neutral is your bag. You want me to be far away from you. So just blocking and push blocking me away, that's a win. You push don't blocking get... and then calling brass at the lower levels is basically like calling a DP assist. Yeah, no, brass brass is a DP assist <laughs> from a certain perspective. Yeah, like it's it's amazing. I, I I say this because that's something I notice in myself is I get very uh, I get addicted to the big hit, the big reversal into a combo, into a setup, and yada yada yada. Sometimes a win is just getting out of the corner or getting out of pressure. And you just have to learn to be happy with that because there's some very safe and very egregious nonsense in this game <laughs> that you just have to hold. And you just have to be happy with, hey, I blocked it. I didn't block the fifth mix up afterwards, <laughs> but I blocked the first one. We'll build off of that. So th that that would be my recommendation. Um, you kind of had a couple of wins with her little anti-air jump back move, but that's more to punish people trying to avoid your, uh, uh, what's the word, command grabs rather than uh, yeah. just a jump in reversal. So you had some wins with that, but that's very like particular spacing. The way we recommend to do it, and this is a little complicated to explain, but there's a mechanic called land canceling. And basically when you land on the ground, it'll stop whatever blocks done you're in. 
So the way we usually recommend dealing with Beowulf Jump and Heavy Punch is you jump up right before it's going to hit you so that you're in the air when it hits you. And then you'll land and you'll recover before Beowulf will and you can punish him with the full combo. But that's hard as hell to do, <laughs> especially for a beginner. No one does it. We, we joke that's kind of a meme solution, but it is the correct solution. It's the solution that's going to get you the best return when you can actually do it. But I'd say level your at, just uh, block, push block. That's going to be good. And hey, if you're if you're feeling saucy, do a super, you know, do uh, the fucking True. windmill thing, whatever it's called. Uh, Diamond just... Dynamo. I, yeah, Diamonds Diamond are Dynamo. forever. That's yeah. also an option. <laughs> A bad yeah, one. So, don't don't do that as an anti yeah. Do that if they're like right on top of you. That's another thing I noticed about beginners though, is that they're terrified to spend meter. Spend meter! You right. can't take it with you. Have fun. Have fun with it. Super moves are the coolest thing in this game. <laughs> there is fun mm. fun as heck to do super moves. Go just be Every bar with you them. don't span spend goes to bands for a 1k think about exactly. that. Exactly. Exactly. <laughs> he need, it's ban it's big bands pension fun. <laughs> he needs that. He be uh, who's are right, you Justicar, thanks so much for stopping by we're gonna move on into intermediates because that was it get out of the lobby <laughs> get you if you could lobby we'll get the next peoples in here uh what was that ryuki versus j dog if they're here otherwise it's gonna be a uh open lobby Baghdad will be handling the intermediate open lobbies because, as mentioned earlier, I'm just a beginner player. Huh? <laughs> oh, oh, yeah, I could do that. <laughs> Solo Peacock feels like a good character for intermediates. Hell yeah. I mean, some of these intermediates I mean, are just our here. friends. <laughs> But some of these intermediate players oh, are just like the people wait, really? we actually play by. Like Sheep and Carter. <laughs> in, in oh, the oh, they're... Like, oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> is, it, is it too long to join intermediate? You... So I don't tell anyone to join, like, what they should be joining. Join at your own pace. If you want yeah, to be a beginner, be a beginner. If you're an intermediate, yeah, the, go for it. <laughs> yeah, it, intermediate is very much a question of what you feel comfortable with. If you... Some people just, like cannot handle the mental stress of going on stream in front of like 30 people and getting their 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 back blown out by someone it's just miserable uh, I like so the way you, you worded that i i, I tried <laughs> <laughs> i was i was gonna say something much worse that i was like oh i can't oh, no. say that <laughs> I, I tried no, I can't, I can't. Hey, some people don't like getting their butt kicked on stream and it's if you feel more comfortable playing against a beginner that's fine i think the only time we would like force someone into intermediate is they're just like absolutely destroying the beginner. Uh, yeah. like if you're demolishing people it's it's very much you don't belong here so it's like... yeah <laughs> yeah but you know there's there's no requirement for joining intermediate so if you feel like you're ready or you just even if you don't feel like you're ready but you feel like you would benefit from playing that caliber of player more yeah. than go go right ahead yeah. We'll pay him for sure. Uh, do I have to sign up for something? Yes. If you're gonna sign up for Get Great, there's there's a uh, a sign up link in the announcements channel. But first time that the Andy's gotten in so far, it's schmixy, but we drop Ooh. it. That's bad, unfortunate. You gotta be careful about block strings. If you're gonna, if you're gonna block something, honestly, just stay with the block, um, and then push block when you feel like it's necessary. Uh, you don't you don't want to just be blocking and then suddenly stop blocking to try to punish something like that just leads you to getting punished pretty hard. Overhead. Mixy. Mix. There it is. There's the sign up form right there. Oh. We have to spend two bar. Did we know that? Yes. That's not oh, the one no. to spend the bar. No, with you had, yeah, I think <laughs> I think for the command groups you have to wait for them to hit the ground and they can pick up off of the the little green. It flash. doesn't work because they bounce. No. Well, well, no, no, because I can. Oh, I guess that is in the air. So. Good fingers. Nice. Mixy, I would try for the grab reset. Oh, we committed oh, to the button, which we shouldn't have. I love that punish. I love that. Punish. Oh, that was. You waited until it was done. You got the counter hit combo. Oh, but then we didn't commit to the anti air. That you kind of have to hold that to be honest. If you're going to yeah. do stand heavy punch, you have to hold it. Because it's not, it's not exactly a reversal thing, but it's like the most decent thing that she has out of her kit. 
it is a reversal in like five parentheses yeah <laughs> you don't you don't want to call it like it's a dp you want to call it like it's a poke almost an armored poke of sorts yeah. a good way to think about it is like almost as if you would call brass to deal with something Dude. Man. What are your opinions on the training mode stage? What are my opinions on what? The training mode stage. The training stage? Yes. I hate I like it. the training stage. I like the training stage. <laughs> I as far I'm, as training I'm, stages go, it's good, Schmitz. but it took me like no cap thirty hours to beat this game's tutorial and I was just stuck Man. on the training <laughs> stage hearing that music for all thirty Ooh, of those hours. I, I, I was just gonna say I'm now. not the biggest fan of the music it. here, but yeah. I do like the stage. I like the stage, yeah. The music is kinda Yeah, like I think it's, it's a, a very cute things. training stage. Yeah. I also I'm, I'm of the opinion it's super cool that they put Sonic. Oh, that's a DHC, in the background. okay. Inter Oof. Interesting choice. You definitely could have uh, gotten Philia in on that action. Yeah, yeah <laughs> you did not that, have like, to I guess we just did the wrong GP. super because Gregor was the option yeah. there and said, that's a punish. It was either the wrong oh. super or they thought Bella was mid <laughs> instead yeah. of oh, uh, Annie. <laughs> Which is absolutely a thing that happens hey, birthday. to me. Okay. Um, I, I would like this stage more if we had our custom stage back um, because someone True. made a custom stage for Get Great and it was so True. legit. Uh, and Dude, there was a that... little thonking in the chair. It was beautiful. Like... <laughs> Yeah, no, the custom stage was great. So good. It was so good. Oh, whoa. Sonic. Uh, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. Oh, nice. Good parry. Dude, you parry. didn't believe, though. Didn't believe in the conversion. I did not. I, I'm very happy with them not commit over committing to that 2MK. Uh, a lot of robos will 2MK, and the second they see it collide with anything, still yeah. autopilot into 5 HP, it's really yeah. good to not do that. So, it's like we're still Ryuki, getting our bearings here on, on the robo. Ryuki, it is working out for you right now, but there is no need for you to go in like that. Just, you have yeah. meter, you you even have a life lead. Just wait it out. Wait for him to throw a beam that whiffs, and then just uh, pillar and punish him. You can convert from full screen, it'll be fine. That's oh. your win. You don't have to go in. Oh, even if you <laughs> play a rushdown character. No, no, no. No, you're still here. You're good. It hasn't even happened yet. We just started on the interview, so you're good. Seems like we're still getting used to Robo. Because Robo's mostly kind of like this. Not, not the zoning character, but the second zoning character in this game. He is a zoning character. That is definitely the case. <laughs> she certainly likes it when people aren't directly on top of her. True, because she doesn't have many good reversal options out of the corner besides like trying to up forward and helicopter out. So like, Would you say a character is more up. defined by their strengths or their weaknesses? Both, in fact. In Skullgirls, I decide a character's worth based on how they play around push block. No, I'm not I'm not talking about power level. Like I literally mean like oh, we, okay. we classify Robo as a zoner and, and you said something along the lines of, well, she certainly doesn't like being close. So which get, just kind of made me think like if she did like being close, would that mean she's no longer a zoner? Or like if she didn't have that weakness? Well, we can't exactly like this game has like so many archetypes. Mm -hmm. Um and then the most recent characters have literally blurred those lines. But so then it's like, can you really categorize anybody into a true archetype besides I mean, like yeah, vanilla like, people? Peacock definitely so like... likes it whenever you're on the other side of the screen and she's throwing a million, you know, bombs at you. Yeah. But then yeah. at the same time, she can call M item drop and then sprint at you. So it's like, yeah, is she I've... rush down? Is she zoner? Yeah, I mean, I'm, I make okay? the joke. I yes. make the joke all the time that I play Peacock as a rushdown grappler. So, <laughs> I mean, she has a, she does have a grab super. So I guess you could True. say she is a grappler. That's from a certain you can't say side. that that's dumb yeah <laughs> just it's like you, you can't exactly f fit characters into proper archetypes anymore in this yeah. game like umbrella is yeah. literally three different ide ideas and they're all confused so it's like <laughs> yeah i i will say i thought i remember crank uh philosophizing on how uh archetypes are handled in this game i thought it was so cool when you described bella and peacock as like the most extreme possible versions of a grappler oh, and a zoner again. possible. Like they have every possible tool that that archetype could want. And I just I thought that was such a cool approach to a fighting game. Yeah, like Bella definitely has massive grabs that do tons of damage and give really good conversions that are incredibly fast. But, but then she, she also, can also sprint at you full play? screen, with right? Her and her lows yeah. go farther than my mids. <laughs> yeah. 
that is, evil it is kind character. of rough. Anyway, sorry for not giving literally any advice to that last round. <laughs> um, <laughs> you guys did fine. <laughs> I mean, for the most part, you played, uh, I'm, I'm actually game, really, just... really impressed with that robo play. That robo play was very reserved. Mm -hmm. Something that robos definitely need to have. Uh, throwing out buttons and doing things that you're not supposed to just get that character obliterated. Yeah, and I, I would say that um, the, the Annie player could afford to be a little bit more reserved. I, I noticed a couple times they seemed to be going in when they didn't really They were definitely to. getting push blocked out and then just immediately yeah. ID, ID uh, jump medium punch back in. Yeah, yeah. And yeah, sometimes it worked and sometimes they got anti yeah, I will say, I will say something I noticed that happened several times is that Robo threw out a uh, Tiger Knee H beam, and that doesn't hit a standing Annie, and you were wide open to hit her with pillar and just be off to the races. You had meter, uh, but you weren't able to do that because you were rushing in and just weren't able to like take a moment and realize that. So try, try and when you're playing Robo, slow down a little bit more and wait for that. That's a huge part of how you get in on her is reading what the next beam is going to be and punishing or reacting appropriately. I'll appreciate So we got ourselves Papa John's versus Lord Gyro. Papa John's, the day of reckoning approaches. <laughs> Does anyone remember that quote? Why did he say that? Was he like oh, he, he was like that. getting fired, and then he just yeah. randomly came out with that? Well, no, he was. And then we had he a was play. already fired. That was the thing. He had already been fired oh, for like a year, fired? and then he oh. he ate like thirty pizzas in thirty days, and he was like, oh, "There's a storm coming." <laughs> yeah, and then we had the Whirling. plague, and it's like, yeah, "Oh my it's god, like, Papa John. Yeah, he was right. <laughs> he was right all along, dude. It's crazy." When am I supposed to push as Robo full screen? Once you've conditioned, so I, I, I'm not the best Robo player, but I do have a little bit of experience with her. And I do play Peacock, who's a very adamant zoner. Um, once you've conditioned them to be jumping at you, uh, that's a, usually a good time for you to try and run under them so that you can gain back screen control. Alternatively, uh, if you have some kind of lockdown assist or some kind of, you know, other kind of assist, you just kind of get a feel for it. Yeah. Whatever they're in some form of disadvantage, maybe they just blocked your beam and assist. You can run at them and try and bait something out or press some kind of button. I'm sort of You're kind of anticipating getting push blocked with her as well. Uh, five LP, mind. five LP into two MP is kind of like your bread and butter uh, yeah. on block. Um, because I, I think you're plus one on two MP. Yes. And it's very, very fast. That. So even if you whiff, it's like, all right, I can immediately go back to zoning. Oh, I appreciate oh, and, and this is kind of a, a learning how to learn thing, but in the course of these replays, we tend to give a lot of advice, uh, a little too much sometimes, and it's really hard to even remember, much less like process and then implement all of that. So I would recommend if you're watching these videos and you just you're struggling to remember even what we said, much less how to respond to it, just pick like one thing and take a week yeah. and just practice that one thing. And it, it can be a small thing, mm. like just reading robo beams or practicing getting in when you are practicing conditioning and then getting in but just like try and focus on like one or two manageable things instead of trying to do everything at once and then forgetting it and then getting mad at yourself for forgetting yeah the most part it, it kind of depends on how you want to play with robo but like doing the keep away and try to bait bait options with robo is pretty legit just as a mm -hmm. strategy by itself yeah pick a thing Try to figure out what you want to do with that thing. Get good at that thing. Succeed. Yes. If you picked Eliza, you are winning. How often should I be trying to reversal with Robo HP? Uh, if it were me, I'd say not as often as most people would it, have you. It's a defensive mix-up, in my yeah. opinion. <laughs> yeah. That's the one with the saw, right, and all the armor moves? That's the saw. Yeah. Yeah. That's it only has one hit of armor, so it loses to pretty much anything that's multi hit or fast enough. It only has one hit? That's crazy. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Four, at least so that's two. when people are like, nope. this is a great reversal. I'm like, no, you will literally die. <laughs> yeah. That's, it's that's crazy. Not a great reversal. What what makes it good is that you can use it and then call some kind of like lockdown assist and if it trades with your armor or you call like a better armored assist or reversal assist, no. right? And that's what makes it okay. Yeah. But it's not good if they're right on top of you. If they're right on top of you, just don't. 
Just push Fervent. one of them out and then wait for them to try and come in with something bad and dumb. Fervent Black, if that is genuinely your dream, you should play Peacock Robo because that's that's how that team plays. You just My dream of only Peacock zoning and, and never plus. approaching with Robo Rational. Yeah, uh, just... With only Robo? No. No. Yeah. But if if your if your dream is to just sit at full screen and throw nonsense at your opponent and just hang out there for a while, uh, uh, Peacock Beam is your bag. That's going to be a lot of fun for you. That's just what that team does. <laughs> uh, right, so what are, who we got next? It's Papa John's versus Lord Gyro, which they haven't. They pinged them, so. Oh, Papa John's is online. They were idle before. Um, as for the dash under, it's so difficult to read a random jump and dash under. Once you get your characters more down to an autom automated response, right? Like, like you're just kind of doing things without even thinking, right? You're not thinking about throwing a beam, you're just doing it, right? Uh, once that gets to the case, then it becomes a lot easier because you, instead of having to think about what you're doing, you can just be like, oh, I see my opponent is jumping, I'm going to run now. And it becomes less of a read and more of a, you know, you're looking for something reaction. Yeah, yeah. Something and and to be f yeah. to be fair, uh, a lot of this is coming from a place that me and Baghdad and JP are at, where we're not so focused in on what we're doing that we can't think about what the opponent is doing. So just keep that in mind if you're kind of struggling to do that. You're still very much at a stage where you're more concerned with like what you're going to do and how, rather than how to adapt your opponent's strategy. That's something yeah. that'll come with time. Um, you should really only be worried about tiger kneeing, like, M-beams if you catch your opponent, like, jumping a lot. It, it's like the anti-stay-out-of-the-air tool. Uh, and aside from that, you just kind of want to stay pretty grounded, I would say. Yeah, coming from the perspective of playing against Robo, uh, I tend to see, it, it tends to be a 50-50. If I think they're going to do the grounded lower beam, then I'm going to jump, and that's how I'm going to get in, and the way you punish that is tiger kneeing. So just watching your opponent and getting a good understanding of how they like to approach you will be your answer there. If they're very grounded, they want to dash block in, going for the low beams is good because you can just fire those off one after another, after another, after another. But if they're trying to jump in, H beams your bag. Oh, we'll grab some food. Okie dokie. Yeah, Papa John's, you're up. And I don't even know where our Lord Gyro is. They're, they're certainly not in Discord. Please, if you're participating tonight, go in our Discord. So I did joke. I did joke earlier, but uh, my my rule for the lobbies is that chat gets first dib if the yes, slot opens if it's up. The lobby. So, does anyone in chat care to play the Papa John? Papa John needs to get in here. Get in the dangle lobby, man. JD being aerial wouldn't necessarily help you getting reflected because she could still reflect the air beams. Yeah. Um. If if you're getting reflected. You want to try and do it, do the beams in a situation where she can't reflect. So you can during... also do stuff like five HP into beam to like if she's just trying to react to you doing anything with I fingers, know. which is kind of what she has to do in order to reflect beam. Yeah. Uh, you can do five HP into beam, and that'll catch it. Uh, you can also just you know run up and do a button. Yeah, that's that's how I get on Bellas as Annie that are just absolutely fishing for a reflector is I'll throw out H Crescent and then I'll jump in on them and they're too just focused in on doing getting the reflector and then I just blow them up. We only play three. Yeah, it's only three. First to three. It's not it's not first to three, it's flat. Oh, three. it's just three. Just three. Yeah, just, just three. three Folks, some wins and losses in this place. Yeah, th this is about learning. It's fine. And I would encourage you guys at home, don't treat the stream as a tournament set or as like a genuine reflection on your abilities as a player. Treat it as a space to try new stuff, try things out, and uh, treat it as like a safer place to fail as yeah. just an area where the focus is learning. Try out some weird stuff, things you wouldn't necessarily do in game or whatever. You're here to get feedback, not to win. Yeah. yeah. Show what I, you've I, learned and learn from what you've shown yeah, yeah. it's it's a yeah. it's supposed to be a controlled environment so it's like there's no pressure if you want to test some things out go for it like we're we're here to help <laughs> not judge so I, I see my fellow glue sommelier has some resets as a big band 
but it's just kind of going for them a little too aggressively and in weird places. Oh, I would. We give this advice if you're really planning on sticking to solo big band. We give this advice to all of them. You need to optimize. You because solo big band almost any ratio should be able to two touch if not one touch everybody. That's all the trace. Like that. <laughs> I think for just kind of noticing off off the cuff, Papa John's was very aggressive. Maybe a little yeah. bit too aggressive. <laughs> Julia is the air dash character. She is. You, uh, try to get in your face character, but you don't want to. You don't want to commit to that. No, Shab, I'm saying, I'm saying you want to be more optimal to reduce the amount of resets you do because Big Ben does not have the the nastiest of mix-ups in this game. He he likes a strike throw. He likes his little gimmicky low high, but it's for you're not going to be getting the crazy double stuff. He except loves for that it with when Big you are in hard push. knockdown and he is in his range and you are not in your range. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and if you disagree with any of my opinions, meet me in the pit. <laughs> get, get a lobby up, fight me for the right to have your opinion. Trial Ooh. of combat. Oh, what a grip. That was really good grip. That's Are why I'm only allowed to then? criticize Baghdad's uh, opinions if I beat him. Yeah, so we're running H HPD Sun, which is... Uh, it's an assist. Honestly, you're you're better benefited with M yeah. or L because of the faster startup, or the more hits from from M. Yeah, the the purpose H of H beat extend is not to do damage. It's to play defense, and M just does that job uh, far better. It has the same That's range cool. and faster startup. Yeah, you see the slower startup, and the band just get, instantly got punished. Beat, yeah. Oof, and you certainly should not be calling a DP assist from yeah, full screen. Yeah, do not call him from full screen. Against the solo band, you're asking to get brassed. Especially when the opponent's oh, like you. not inclining to 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 pressure up pressure up against you. Like, Chub was definitely like <laughs> full screen. Oh, snap! 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 Do we know how to snap? Do we know Just our snap. snaps? No, don't kill! Don't kill! Okay, no. Phew, thank God. Oh, good, and we get that the was hit. very That's aggressive. Nice, nice grip. Decent reset. Ga, ga, ga. Okay. So yeah, you need to yeah. learn the corner conversion for that because you could you could have killed me. You still had sound stun. You still had a lot of damage on the table. Yeah, and and now you now you lost yeah. access to level three for that, which you know it didn't matter here, but it could easily matter in a future scenario. A huge part of improving on your big band play is improving your meter management because he is. He loves meter. He loves having meter, and he goes through it very, very fast. So you need to absolutely minimize the amount you're using it. Especially because Big Ben optimal skip ratio, so it doesn't matter. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. You don't. You do not need to spend meter to get damage as Big Ben. <laughs> like the most unoptimal combo in the world is Big Ben one v three. He still one touches with three bar. Yeah. It's very, very silly. <laughs> Yeah, you want you want to save the meter for SSJ reversals because it's the fastest reversal in the game, and it makes a lot of stuff that should be safe unsafe. That's and it. you want to save it for level three and level five TODs. Hey, hey, Schmixy, nice. So JP, when do you think it, uh, a player should go for a reset? Uh, should be like after the first string, middle of the combo. Ooh. Depends on the character. Mm -hmm. Uh, yeah, A, depends on the character. B, depends on how efficient you are with Undizzy, essentially. Um, because for there was a time where the meta was doing early resets. So you would get, like, 50 Undizzy, and then you start resetting. Um, but that's not normally the case when you're playing in a live match. So it's like... Yeah. It, it depends on what kind of reset you're going for and what scaling edge you're going for. Yeah, like, if, if you're playing... Uh, any cats or cat or cat any right you have your one reset point and if you're right you kill your opponent <laughs> if you're wrong well there we go perfect you can just join get great if, if you're yeah if you're going to be too much of a yeah, bully but... to people you'll just play me or jp or whoever's on the mic that week <laughs> like it's Pretty much. It, there's not like a skill cap here <laughs> yeah but it become optimal. It's more than just become optimal. It's, it's, yeah, it's but also become optimal. <laughs> <laughs> that is part of it. 
you, you gotta optimal is not just getting bigger damage out of your combos it's like being more intelligent about yeah. your and there's, there's and varying damage. degrees of optimal yeah also, it sounds like we're ragging super hard on Glue Sommelier, but it's just because Big Man's a relatively simple character that we all have a lot of hours in. You did yeah. fine. You are, you are good. We just know a lot about Big Man, so we have a lot of advice to yeah. give. <laughs> so like, don't, don't, don't feel bad if you feel like we're overly criticizing you. That's just that's where we're coming from. We know a lot about the character. <laughs> the, the number one thing I can say about Papa John's is he needs to take a breather and slow it down, man. Yeah. You yeah. were calling it brand from full screen. You, you never just stood there and saw what Shub was doing. You were just yeah. kind of going a million miles an hour, and you really need to pick your uh, pick your entry, I guess you could say, with Philia. Yeah, I totally agree. I, I said earlier that the biggest return on investment thing is practicing B&Bs. The second biggest return on investment thing is not panicking. It's just learning to slow down and keep your wits about you during the game and not just freak out and be like, I got to get in, got to get in, got to get in, got to get in, no matter what. Just learning how to slow down and think even a little bit. Uh, you know, you're coming from the true glue sommelier here. <laughs> you don't have to think a lot. <laughs> but even just slowing down for that one second and going, huh, I could probably bait him into doing something dumb if I just hold down back for like one second. <laughs> even that will save you and win you games. <coughs> Up next, we got that is Phelps. I think that was Felipe. I jumped, jumped in here. Ah, uh, yes, fervent black. The three yeah. modes of peacock neutral. I am an advantage. I am an advantage, <laughs> and I have item drop held, and I'm being hit. <laughs> <laughs> I thought I was, I was about to say. I thought they were going to be. I'm an advantage. I'm an advantage. Oh God! I, I was going to be oh, like, God. oh, and I'm also an advantage. <laughs> That's what it was. <laughs> okay, so you're up next, Felipe. I see that you're in the Twitch chat. Pretty good. Here's the lobby link. Please join our lobby. We're playing on beta. If you can, please, please join our Discord. Yeah, it seems a lot easier. Shout out to the Get Great Discord. You guys are great. Yeah. Well, well you're getting there. A lot of fun. <laughs> <laughs> True. You're, you're allowed to stay, uh, contrary to popular belief, you are allowed to stay in the server after you get yes. great. You do not. You do not have to leave. <laughs> you, ju you just graduate to talking on stream after that. <laughs> I, well, either some, that or you people. get poached by cc and d yeah, i guess so. poached <laughs> yeah poached. We, we've lost mao to Hunted cc and d off and dragged to league of legends oh god yeah. what a worse well, no, well no Every... not the new things war uh warframe now oh no that's even worse <laughs> every time i go in there i go into the everyone is in the skullgirls voice chat and none of them are playing skullgirls <laughs> no, of course everybody's just chilling you know <laughs> Whenever Warframe came out, I had a buddy, right? And I had, I had been friends with this guy for like three years online. Oh, man. And I, whenever Warframe came out, like properly came out, because I had like a really crazy beta cycle, um, I just kind of lost all contact hey, with him for three years. Oh, my. And I had no idea what happened. And then I found out he had made like a new Steam account specifically for Warframe because he had like 180 friends from Warframe. Oh, wow. And he had just been oh, doing Warframe stuff. God. And in August? those three years, he had like 7,000 hours in Warframe. And I'm like, what's Jesus. your opinion on Warframe? And he's like, I hate it. <laughs> <laughs> That's how you, you only learn to like truly hate a game after hate a, a game. thousand hours. Yes. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> You need another game. Yeah. Let's see. We're waiting on Felipe though. Felipe is definitely here. This. I think they went. To, what did they say? They went to go get food. Uh, we can just delay if that's the case. Oh. You see? I can hop in there. I don't mind. There you go. Yeah, I guess good in there. Okay. You're gonna be, gonna be playing against a uh, solo squiggly. Solo squiggly. All right. Get my controller plugged in. Oh yeah, I think I've played like before. Yeah. I'll rock solo P. <laughs> I can make her neutral immaculate. Uh. 
it's really hard to do with robo because can you imagine trying to do perfect play zoning it's really hard actually <laughs> yeah like you're run you're wrong on one beam oh poop they're in wow yeah. who knew that so playing it's, perfect it's would be difficult. difficult that's so it's surprising <laughs> i should show the video of like optimal um robo zoning with heckin level three install because oh my god <laughs> Block. It's hard. The blocks. The thing that I've noted from like Seminator of, of the matches that I play with them, just like on and off stream, um, and like in, in matches, um really good really good defense for the most part. Um but then it's like to a fault. Too defensive. Then they get just they just yeah, get they're, they're de they are definitely a down back king. Yeah. Hey, I was a down back king for a long time. <laughs> that was just you do that was eventually learn just... that you know you don't have to down back. It is okay yeah. to just release the block button for a little bit to try to test the button. Yeah. That was my bag though. Like for a very long time, that's how I got hits. I would just block oh, until man. someone did something unsafe and I'd punish them and I'd get games off of that. That's not bad, but you do need to learn to progress past it. Yeah. Uh, no, Especially uh, against Peacock. You can actually just run up there. The bomb will always miss. Yeah. Well, it's like the bomb had, uh, has light tracking, so it's like... I, I don't know how important This is a necessary OTV reset. That's squares. very rude. <laughs> but uh, if, if you've got the opportunity to kill and you can do it without meter, do it. <laughs> yeah. Yep. Also, don't get hit by George. True. George is very strong here. George is very strong here. <laughs> yeah. <That's what> <laughs> And also, against Peacock, you want every, like, scrap of chip health you can get. True. <laughs> <laughs> Argus Agony. Alright, we're gonna be here a That's while. so much damage. Argus Agony! <laughs> oh, so no. I've done, I've done the think. math, and double Argus does more damage than Lenny Argus. No, I didn't. Yeah, yeah. yeah Dragon Bite would I've gone into the lab. But I'm, I'm not gonna... Make people sit through that, dude. Yeah, but it's funny. Argus, Ag Argus, Ag Listen, Argus, 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 Argus. All I ask is for a level five, so I don't have to put people through this, man. <laughs> I don't want to be but there. It's funny. She's like the one character that can DHC into herself. <laughs> that's that's actually problematic with Peacock and Annie too. Is sometimes you you don't want to DHC and then they just end up doing their own super again because you did it too late. <laughs> Yeah. Or it's like mm, I could go into SSJ, or I could do way more damage by looping supers three times. Yeah. It's just hard. It's difficult. You yeah, got trying that... to escape. Yeah. What what makes this zoning setup so onerous to deal with, especially That's as a, a solo? Nice. Is uh, the the setups with George? They you'll notice that Baghdad is never teleporting until he has a George Whoop. on screen to cover him. Whoops! I didn't punish him. Good grip. Got to push it off out uh, there. Try to challenge your your wake up. Rip. Whoa. Rip. Good grip. I got like rolled back out of my push block. Yeah, we don't we don't do the normal squiggly schmixy with stand medium punch without which I wonder why. We go into grabs a lot. And sometimes grabs are just what works. Not for squiggly though, because only because of the scaling. Because like mm. Twiggly kinda needs the damage and like you're gonna re reduce your damage to fifty five percent it's kind of oof. Yeah. Oh item drop. Hey, hey, hey. Oh, rip. Oh. Okay. Oh, no, 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 no. Ah, okay. Yay. We oh, get no. some extra credit. Okay, this is good. Oops. <laughs> this is this is very good for a lag here. Hey, 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 hey. And they also go full undizzy. You need more resets. Yeah. Full undizzy is nice. Uh, yeah, I, I very, I very much get the impression of a, a very recently graduated beginner, someone who's like yeah. just gotten past the point of you know getting wins. They they have B and Bs. They they're aware of things. They just need to like build up the good habits now. Uh, fuck. Boom. That was a good idea. You need to be careful though. 
There it is. Yeah, oh, we did. My <laughs> I was about to say, are, are you on the level of hatred and evil in your heart that you've labbed Lenny's specific combos, or are you just yeah. going in for the heck of it? <laughs> and we just escape the corner because we can. Honestly, yeah, we just had to go in. Yeah, they were. Not your time. And honestly, you didn't have to. Like, peak uh, Squiggly's bag is just catching people full screen with a uh, sing Aria. Uh, yeah. the, the, the thing that drags him in, and then you do the super. You could have very easily waited for a peacock to commit to a button and then blow him up. Dive kicks that. are also incredible in this matchup for avoiding bombs. Uh, TK yeah. dive kick gets you right into my dead zone very quickly. Um, and your slender frame, uh, as long as you're like dash jumping forward and you know normal jumping backwards, item drop has a very hard time tracking you. I'm of the opinion Squiggly has by far the weirdest hurt boxes in this game. It's probably objectively yeah. Bella, but for some reason I just have the hardest time comboing Squiggly. Like combos work on everyone else and not Squiggly for whatever reason. So the timing that you we need to get you to practice the timing. That's the only way to win this matchup. <laughs> Oh, that was absolutely punishable. You let him, you let him fly in your face, like. <laughs> also, JH, JHP for Squiggly is not the end all, be all for controlling the neutral. So you should not be focusing on trying to use that all the time. That's because because it's a huge button doesn't mean that it's good. And, uh, ooh. George is okay, on the screen. So yeah, yeah gotta, gotta look out for George. There's probably a certain spacing you can do to avoid that. Oh, uh, when items. she gets to trade in her favor. Oh, oh. items. <laughs> Evil. Not JP, yeah. So, yeah. Oh, so for the people at home who don't know, uh, Squiggly, or not Squiggly, Peacock gets a reputation of none of her projectiles disappearing when they hit her. The only projectiles that don't disappear are the bombs. To be fair, those are by far the most annoying hey, projectiles. Hey, I would not have done that at really all. Bad. That was, no, that was bad for them. I understand you wanted to get out of out of a situation, but do not try to sacrifice your, your health for that. You could have grabbed there yeah. and that would have uh, helped. So He tried so, to at the end there, but the camera picked yeah. <laughs> yeah. the camera. Second. Yeah, so the reason rough. I was bringing that up is Baghdad has been doing a very good job of using item defensively, basically just dropping it right as a uh, ex amateur is jumping in on them. Uh, but good. item goes away on hit. Uh, so if you're able to like get a grab or just hit them, if you're afraid of <laughs> item, the hit will make it go away, along with Avery. There's also a 30 frame lockout uh, whenever I block anything uh, until after I leave block stun before I can drop the item. Um, now I don't have to drop the item if I block something, but it is also an option. And you, you are a lot safer to run pressure after I've blocked something than otherwise. Um, another thing is jump heavy punch is not disjointed. You should not be treating it like it is. I can just call any of my items and it'll beat that out. Um, you want to try and get directly above me and fall on top of me with uh, dive kicks because Peacock's anti-air is like up in front of her and your dive kick kind of angles yourself into the back of her head whenever you do it. So you should be trying to get into that sweet spot where you're directly above her uh, before you try, you know, an approach. It it's a pain because you see all of that screen space and you also know, oh, she has a teleport. And she could just leave. Um... Sometimes it works, the JHP. I mean, yeah, sometimes it works, but s sometimes everything works, you know what I mean? Yeah. You, you ultimately don't want to be putting out on the yeah, box you, if you don't have to. You don't want <laughs> to be throwing it out. Like, even me just calling an H-bomb smokes it because the H-bomb spawns behind me anyways, and it'll just land on it. Yeah. Um, aside from that, you do a pretty good job uh, defensively. You're not getting opened up like by dumb stuff, but at the same time, you're also push blocking things you definitely shouldn't. If I throw a bomb in your face, uh, I'm minus two. You you can definitely punish me there. You shouldn't be push blocking me out. Um, now I can Gatling that bomb into something else, and that's what makes Peacock stupid. Uh, and I don't have to throw a bomb, <laughs> but uh, it's all just part of the mental stack. Uh, but aside from that, you did pretty well. Yeah. Uh. Yeah. 
Anything you want to say, JP? No, I think I think you got it. <laughs> Thanks so much for All the right. follow, Preach. Get out of the lobby. <laughs> All right, friend. There's your three. We have to get Felipe in here. Because they have just returned. Please, Felipe, if you since you are here, please join our Discord. It is three. Can I play Felipe? Uh sure. sure. Yeah. Flat tree today. Yeah. Let's go. Thanks so much for the follow, Preach. So Felipe, you are here. Let me one more time. Here. What should I play against? Them. Please join Felipe. Our... I don't actually know what this is. I have no idea was. what they play. This is the first time I see. Yeah. I'll just I'll go with Solo Beowulf then. <laughs> That's very nice, PGs. <laughs> <laughs> Fair. <laughs> Fair. <laughs> Fair. <laughs> I, I do play Peacock, so I expect those. <laughs> yeah, <it's okay. laughs> if they're a GG, I lost. <laughs> <laughs> So I lost sometimes, handedly. Oh, <laughs> you just have to give yourself permission to be salty. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's got to be like okay with. with oh, being, dude, I my uh, character's man, bullshit. Already, I know it. Yeah, you're already you're already in Felipe. Well, you're already here, so you're good. <laughs> you're yeah. in the game. Just, now. just a hit set ready on the left hand side. Yeah. Also, solid uh, Steam profile pick. Magda, is that like a your your profile on Steam? Is that like a, a character or like a an OC that you made and commissioned uh, art for? So, I I took the Scout Team Fortress Two model, I colored his shirt pink, I took Faust's head from uh, Guilty Gear Zerd, like a model pack on the SFM workshop, and I took goggles from <laughs> what was it? What were the goggles from? I don't remember. Okay. Uh, Oh, the lobby died. Right, okay. Planeswalker goggles. Wait, it, I don't. It no, might no. not have died. Oh, we'll we'll no. see. We'll see. Oh wait. Oh. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. oh. I've never. I've yeah, never seen the timer reset before. That's hilarious. That's, <laughs> that's, that's a strange. new level of broken. <laughs> it, it's stuck on zero for me. Oh wait, wait, wait. wait. Okay, we're in. We're in. in. Oh, you're in. in. You're in. All right. Yeah. I'm so not I will those. say, Phelps, no, uh, you're playing Peacock Big Band on a Brazilian connection, so you're already doing amazing. Incredible. Phenomenal, even. Yeah. I guess you're. Uh, but anyways, the then I had a buddy of mine port it all to uh, Blender, and that's nice. how it came out. Oh, nice. All right, so yeah, you're gonna have to radio girls it if you're in there. Oh, uh, sorry. Okay, so uh, I just <laughs> so they're playing uh, Peacock Valentine Big Band. I got in on their Peacock, and I did my best to combo them, but I lost my chair mid combo, so I wasn't able to finish things off. I just tagged in their Valentine because I'm an idiot. And I did the wrong tag, uh, <laughs> so uh, they just uh, hit me with Brass now. Um, right now we're in neutral. I'm trying to get a hit in on them, so I can tag in Peacock and finish the job there. I just got my hit off of a bad, um, and I just tagged in the wrong character again. So don't do this at home, kids. Uh, Incredible. <laughs> sorry, it Dog. is really, it is really Ow. hard to play and commentate at the same time. True. <laughs> <It's rude. laughs> okay. Uh, so solid assists overall. I do. I actually, I like H um, Brass on Big Band, and obviously L George is phenomenal. H Brass plus Peacock is dumb. It Big is. Band plus George is dumb. Right. <laughs> I love that reset. I just I just got a raw wolf shoot from the corner, <laughs> which is always fun. Okay. I like that you're not randomly up backing. I've uh, I've gone for a jump in grab a couple of times now, and you haven't bitten. That's really good. Um, Alrighty, and uh, no one can see this, so it's okay. <laughs> Two, no. three. Yeah. Spiritually, you all know what just happened, but <laughs> definitely. Uh, yes, I solid solid play overall. Um, just immediate first impressions is that you uh, you let me get in basically. Uh, unfortunately, that's how the Peacock Beowulf matchup goes. <laughs> Uh, part of my Baghdad is the more skilled player. Than yeah, me. if I'm able to split really... it this time, I can definitely give some pointers here. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I Baghdad is the better player than me, but it's really hard to tell how much better just because this matchup is so skewed that way. 
Give me a hit. Oof. I'm gonna tell you right now, holding down back against Beowulf at round start is not the answer. That is yeah, not the I, answer. Would you say like I, up back JHP and then into Yeah, up back AV? jump heavy punch is an answer. Okay. Yeah. I'll also, I will also say, um, I, I get the philosophy behind uh, your um, your vile assist, but uh, <laughs> I God, how do, have, how do I say this without sounding like the biggest? I understand maniac the philosophy the behind the vile assist, yeah. but but there are there, there's yeah. for Peacock there's a better assist to be had instead of trying to use like vile. Yeah, uh, my path gives I've, you. Uh, actually, you know what? I think orange vile might also give you. I'm trying. I'm trying to think of the nicest way to phrase this, but uh, I'm I'm too good for you to be using that. You should be calling H press on me. <laughs> yeah, obviously, but I'm saying I think it gives you vortex still, so it is an interesting oh, yeah. concept. I could see that, yeah. Hey, 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 hey. I love the Brazilian players. They have such, like, interesting ideas yeah, for teams ideas. and, like, other True. compositions. I like it. What do we want to and... do here? Go for reset. I don't no, know if they, I, I don't no, know if they are that. Brazilian. <laughs> I, I just say, like, yeah, South Brazilian. American. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> so they are? Okay. okay. I love that interaction. I never get that interaction. I just, Sorry. I don't have it on the forms, but it's definitely through Skullgirls. Good block. Okay. Oh, okay. Yeah, no, I saw in the lobby that they, uh, their the connection was from Brazil. Okay. It looks like we're still trying to get a handle on combos right now with Big Band. Combos. I, like I definitely saw a lot of, like, peacock. jump heavy kicks that were just empty in the corner that I think yeah. were supposed to be teleports. Um... But aside from that, I think they had pretty good ideas on, like, where they can be throwing bombs and items and where they can't be. Uh, you should try holding item drop more. Uh, specifically M1. It's very, 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 very powerful. Yeah, and I also... I noticed this uh, a few times, and, and maybe it's just these are the one or two times I can actually remember, so I'm over-exaggerating in my head, but I saw there were a couple occasions where you had opportunities to convert a Speacock, but you just didn't because you were holding down back and you were a little afraid. Yeah. Um, getting just a bit better at res anticipating and then taking advantage of those situations will go a long way for you. All right, good. Go for the good teleport. Mixy. All right, so I do not like that you're using, um, what's it called, H-Bang? Yeah, H-Bang from that distance is not a very good answer. H-Bang leaves you very minus. It, it puts them in block stun for a while, but it also, you know, puts you in an animation for a while where you can't be throwing bombs, repositioning, moving about, you know, peacock things. Also, you should be reversing me more. We're on game three now, and I've not seen a single M bang out of you. That's just frankly unacceptable. <laughs> Potential for you to get out, get yourself out of a situation, and you have reversal to do it. It's worthwhile yeah. trying the option or forwarding out, just like that, which is decent. Yeah, I, I get that you don't want to like get punished or blown up, and I, I definitely appreciate that you had the wherewithal. But it's been three games, and I've not seen it once, and it's one of your, it's literally your only reversal, actually. <laughs> is scalpels a safety HC? It is then, right? It's like pseudo um, safe, kind of like Ukwa's. Safety HC from full screen, sure. Yeah, obviously. <laughs> I screwed that up. I mean, I'm like mentally doing Bayo band combos. <laughs> oh, yeah, so sorry I didn't comment too much. I I have this really bad habit. I forget everything that happens in the game <laughs> almost almost as soon as I'm done playing it. I'm sorry. <laughs> so I, mean, I wish I could give you advice, but I generally don't remember anything that just um, happened. <laughs> it just looked like somebody who is new to the game. You know, somebody yeah. who hasn't learned where they can press, learned where they can't. Uh, and that'll just all be solved the more you play. Uh, obviously, you need to get a little bit more optimal and uh Aside from that, I think you have a very good idea of how you should be zoning with Peacock. Um, but I also think that you should be, you know, pushing the advantage whenever you have the bombs and the item drops off cooldown and they're on the screen. And, you know, 
you can move around more as Peacock. Uh, your backdash is jump cancelable and move cancelable. Uh, I saw you try to do Kara Sweep a couple of times, but you already had L George out. And uh, another option that you can do is you can do Kara into item drop. You can do Kara into teleport. Like, um, you have a million options at all times as Peacock, and you need to be using all of them. I still have like four people to go. I'm gonna slip out real quick and get the oven started so I can uh, eat dinner once we're done. Ooh. And we'll be right back. Some dinner. Very nervous. Um, totally understandable. Oh, dude, it's fine. Uh, calling breaths is always smart. Uh, it's like you, you, Peacock is the best character I think for Brass because she is the best in the game at protecting band. Uh, you can call it, and if they try to punish you, you call item drop and you do Argus, and now that you're eating a whole combo because they tried to hit your assist. Um, so. Like I said, just just play more, and I think you'll get the character down eventually. That just takes some time. Just like just like with the big band and also. Alrighty. Yeah. Like you learn how to you learn how to approach once you've seen more games and you decide to watch replays and stuff like that. You know, usually play much more aggressive. That's totally fair. I mean, it's fair. Yeah, like Peacock can do that. She can do whatever the hell she wants. True. And Liam, please. <laughs> <laughs> I yeah, I know. I don't she want to hold arm. that anymore. <laughs> I've been holding it to. for she three no years. <laughs> <laughs> she can't hold anything, Doc. She has no arms. I'm talking about me holding it. I've had to hold that for she three years. She can't even see Liam's vision. She's blind. <laughs> yeah. True. <laughs> Only seen when she's got the Argus out. Well, she can see. Friend. I don't. I don't she can't see through her eyes, but she can definitely see because she um, watches TV in the story modes. Yeah. Also, oh, yeah. Uh, good pa good uh, player for you to check out, uh, Philippe's, uh If you probably know him, Arrowshire. Uh, he plays Peacock Band. He used it for a while and Doppler. They're two incredible players. Uh, and I Tyrone would wouldn't be. Tyrone wouldn't be bad to check out either. Just for Tyrone's pretty good for Val. Anyway. Yeah. Yeah. Depends on if you want to play Val lane or not. If you want to play Val more aggro, you want to check out Cloud. Yeah. Valentine's. What do we think died, about? I would say I pass. What do we think about the team comp? Uh, P Val band. Obviously, P bands really strong. I think it's but... good. Yeah. Uh, yeah Wing it plays P Val. Uh, oh yeah, Wing it. I should probably th shout out shout oh, out Wing it. Yeah, he Wing plays uh, <laughs> P Val. Yeah. Uh, and they play it pretty well. Uh, L George give or er, L George gives. Uh, Valentine, what do you call it? Uh, a vial off of throw, I'm pretty sure. Uh, I don't know the exact timings to it. Um, oh, it also I gives was... you safe left right with the jump medium punch. The, the what's the one that like vacuums them back towards her? The multi hit on the leg cross thing that she has. I have no idea. I'm not a Val player. Light kick, crutch light kick. <laughs> That's what that, that's uh, nah, the aerial one. Is. The the mm -hmm. one where she'll... God, I don't know. Is it a light kick? Where she's a jump kick? Oh, yeah, that kick? one. Yeah, yeah. She, she, yeah, 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 like, yeah jump light kick. So it gives yeah. you, like, safe left rights on the jump light kick. Uh, it's it's very good. It's a pretty good team. And then bypass obviously gives you a uh, vortex. Um, but I do like what you're doing with the vial. I think that is pretty smart. Um, yeah, I did. I wanted to comment on that earlier, so <laughs> I was struggling to form sentences while I was I would run playing, Green but... Vial, though, because then what happens whenever you run Green Vial is if they get hit by it, they just eat all the bombs until they're at max, un or what do you call it, until they can burst. Yeah. And then they burst. As far as when you're calling it, you were calling it at inopportune times because you were specifically calling it when I was able to move. And so there were occasions where I was able to hit your Valentine, and if you were especially unlucky, I might have been able to get a double snap, which you definitely don't want. You want to be calling that when, at least against Beowulf, when I'm full screen and in block stun. Because then my only real option to punish the assist would be to arm, which is going to cost me meter, and you can just block and explode me for whatever you want. So you were calling it when you were a little too close to me, and when I you weren't enough in advantage. So if you're, if you're ever in doubt about which to call, call Brass call brass more often and only call the vial assist when you're in advantage you kind of have me pinned down that's pretty good 
All right, up next we got Tay versus Dunce. I was gonna ask if this is my local Dunce or if Duncey Poo yes. is a foreign Dunce. Local Dunce. Local Dunce isn't even local to me. That's that's what's so devastating. I feel like the username's Freak. lying. Fleet. Got our we got our e boy tree boy. Their name currently. <laughs> Hello, Parasol. See if Tay's around though. What what is e boy mean? derogatory, in your opinion? What? Is e boy derogatory? Why would it be derogatory? What's I derogatory mean, about it? Some yeah, people what? don't care to be an e boy. Okay. And they don't be, care to be an e, e boy? <laughs> <laughs> What's the problem, actually? <laughs> uh, so it's just it's a it's a it's a term it, you know it's it's a term often used to describe a, a certain type of terminally online young man who vice for too much attention but other people use it as a very uh sort of positive and uh hyper social sort of character so just wanted to engage you guys' opinions people in the oh, early what, 2000s like complained about a b-boy so i'm just like what's what's the difference now like... <laughs> we're, we're progressing through the alphabet by 2030 we'll so. be on uh, g-boys <laughs> we'll have g-boys next yo yeah no that was back in like the 60s with the g-men right uh, the only G-Man I know is a guy who reviews boomer shooters on YouTube. <laughs> 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 oh, I hope Tay is here. Is Yeen in the chat? Yeen's, yeah, that's random rock. You guys need to have con more consistent branding between accounts. You're never I mean, going to build true. become influencers like this. True. Also, I've been thinking, JP... I should probably drop the, the GG8 for my name because I'm way too mean to people on Quick Match. I'm hurting the brand. What are you, need... what are you talking about? I'm on Quick Match all the time. Yeah, but like I, I thought like <laughs> people if I start getting annoyed, I'm just nah, being really mean to them you're in chat. Good. <laughs> you're good. There's a reason we have the image, the get great image with all the yeah, SpongeBob's in a burning house. Literally. <laughs> <laughs> This is why God, the JP, here. JP is so terrible. That's how I feel every time you enter a lobby. <laughs> oh, in the rare occasions I beat you first try. <sighs> oh, it's incredible. <laughs> it doesn't happen often, but the rare times I can be up on JP. Oh, <clears throat> great ego boost. Last night when I beat you once and then you immediately quit. Oh, God, I was on cloud nine. <laughs> Had to go. More important things. <laughs> I know. <laughs> But, but deep in my heart, you were dodging my. me. <laughs> uh -oh, Ruby to rage quit a couple days ago. Oh, uh, what do you no. call it? It was it was while he was still like learning double stuff. Oh, uh, right. He couldn't get in on me like for quite a while. Mm -hmm. He was not having a fun time. What what disparaging Think... things do you have to say about me? Try, <laughs> let's hear him. I guess Tay is not here, so I will right. play you. Woo! I'm gonna, I'm Wait, gonna no, 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 Dunce, you're definitely in chat. Who do you want to play? <laughs> yeah, or, yeah, I guess Dunce can, can, you know, Dunce can pick. Who do you want to play? Oh, is Dry... Okay, so that wasn't uh, Dry Trap preparing, uh, charging an insult. He was targeting me for... So I will now <laughs> posture check <laughs> and, and stretch, and uh, I'll get some water and hydrate. I don't have water on me, so I'll be right back. <laughs> I am also going to grab a drink real quick. I need a sippy. On who you want to play? Oh, it's just between the three of us. What do you want to play between? I feel like you're you're at that at that level. Are you dead? Okay. I will let them know as soon as they come. The the water the water was a good call, dry, because <laughs> I, I I went to the gym for the first time in a while today and I oh, had this God. terrible habit where I'll go to the gym and then I'll run errands immediately afterwards. So I was so dehydrated. Oh, oh <laughs> that that two sips of water idea. hit me like a truck. That's a very bad idea. You always need water with you. Uh Dunce wants to play you back then. Oh, oh shoot. Okay. Uh, one my cat is on top of me. Of course. <laughs> yeah, I see. D Dunce is 
they're they're targeting you, Baghdad, because you're the weakest player in the lobby. It's okay. <laughs> <laughs> it goes me, JP, Baghdad. <laughs> what? I, I think you have that a little out of order. No, 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 no. <laughs> the order is correct. <laughs> That's a solo parasol. Yes, it's, they're they're playing solo parasol right now. Okay, be better at the parasol. I'm Ooh. going to get shot, aren't I? Spicy soul. I thought so. That was a good uh, dash block. Lutz's blocks have been pretty on point lately. Their, their yeah. movement has been pretty good. To get That's good either. spacing. I, I wish I could comment on Dunce's progression, but I just never play them these days. <laughs> oh, we do too fast. Good push block. No confirm off of the JLP. Uh, excuse me. Good block. Lord, dude. Maxi, this is hard to blockable. Uh, yeah, oh. it's hard to blockable. Don't no, block that crouching. Another, another, <laughs> another hard to blockable. Good oh, block. We blocked oh, it that time. Jab, though. Though. Uh, see, they that's what's so devastating about Skull Girls is you'll block layer one of the mix up and then you'll block oh. layer two and three and four and then you'll get hit on five. I think uh -oh. if you block a mix in this game, there should be like confetti flying Could around. The opponent three, should then? lose three quarters of their health. I'm fairly certain they could have level three you. Up back is the thing you want to do. No, be an extend. You know. That's so. Ah, uh, this makes it. Yeah, that's this is rough. Hey, hey, hey! Oh, boom! Oh, oh yes, oh, no. we did it. We dodged. Let's go, Dunce. That was all Dunce's skill. Level three. Good <laughs> idea. Not Baghdad messing up at all. Oh, no. oh, oh that was good go. spacing. No, that was good let's step. go that spacing. Uh, yes. Oh, let's yeah. go. What oh, let's go rest, that spacing. Baby. That was so good. Hey, 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 hey. Schmixie. Baghdad choke. Nice. Oh, oh, no. We get the, we get the grabs. Let's go. Hey, hey, let's go. Get, get the kill. One get the kill. Meet. Yes. Oh, God. Comeback time. Oh, no. Oh, big oh. extent. No confirm. That what? <laughs> Never mind. Yeah. Ga 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 boosh. Still alive. We're still alive. And it's solar ratio. So anything can happen. Hard. Good use <gasps> of. We get the hit. We get the hit. We'll we get want that the corner carry. Understand. Interesting tag. I'm not sure if I agree. I don't know that I agree either. But you know. Yeah. Uh, uh. We don't punish the assist. Oh, we do, but to our detriment. Uh, we're in chip range. It's over. We're in chip range. Uh, it's over. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I honestly, had honestly, honestly, this is this might just be like a, I'm I'm too de I'm detached, so I have the the perspective. But I honestly think you should have carried Big Band into the corner. Parasol has some ungodly setups yeah, on I Big think Band you definitely in the corner. Should have just focus on killing Band. <laughs> yeah, I don't I don't think you should have gone for the snap. I think that was a bad call. Peacock with the Big Band. Especially because B Extend was really covering like a lot of your heckin' options. The big old massive meat shield. He does show up and extend. Sometimes. <laughs> Other times I call him and he gets hit and I'm like, ah, I could be running brass right now. <laughs> I, could, I could be running brass right now. This is bullshit. Approach, fair. <laughs> what do you mean I have approach? to play neutral? Back forward. Understandable. Hey! Oh, oh, oh no. no, we needed to do. We needed to do. Quake. We didn't believe. We didn't believe. We needed to do Quake if we wanted to catch both. Oh, this that game, was good, but of course... This game makes you an anime protagonist. All 90% really of your success rate is believing uh, in would... yourself, the heart of the cards, and the power of friendship. <laughs> hey, hey. Man, bit for one meter. Yeah, don't don't burst bait me there. <laughs> yeah, nah. Oh, oh we no, too, too early. Too early. Nice. Oh, okay. Uh, uh, I hate that setup. Flesh though. Yes. Hey, hey. Oh, Dry, did, nice. did you and I ever play Yu-Gi-Oh? I don't think we ever did. Hey, hey. Go, 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 Say goodbye to Exodia. Damage. <laughs> damage. Huh, oh, less damage good. than I thought, it though. I mean, yeah, you know. It's, I guess it's it was max wrong. scale. I guess it was max scaling with the worst possible ratio. It wasn't. It wasn't scaled. <laughs> It still, it was still wasn't that, that much damage. We were at 235. Oh. Maybe. Ooh. Hey, hey, so yeah, hey, Baghdad, confirm. you definitely could have Almost. punished that if you were a little bit smarter with the PBGC. Oh, we'd parry. We'd, no, oh, Dunce, you're supposed Lord. to grab. <laughs> we're doing it to him. Ga, 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 you're dead. Ga, 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 boosh. 
Do you want to join the Yu-Gi-Oh server dry? <laughs> I'll send you a need right right now. We don't play Yu-Gi-Oh in the Yu-Gi-Oh server anymore. It's the one problem. <laughs> very, very, very quitty. <laughs> and his word, he was like, yeah, I hate Yu-Gi-Oh now. We're not playing anymore. I wanted to, I thought it would be fun to learn. Smile. <laughs> 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 you want to join now? We're talking about in the present. We're not. <laughs> we're not in the past anymore. I'm, I'm asking about right now. You know what sucks about that, this? That's the thing, Random Rock. You don't have to read. <laughs> oh, Many no, of our best kidding. players are illiterate. <laughs> what, what's yeah, all right, cool. I'll, I'll do. Uh, I was gonna say what <laughs> sucks <laughs> is <laughs> this matchup. Oh yeah. yeah. <laughs> Just... This is not a good matchup or a fun time for Parasol yeah, in right, any right, way, right. shape, or yeah, form. There she is. All right, invite has been sent. Dry. You will notice uh, a lot of very it's, bad. It's difficult memes. to deal with, especially with H bomb, <laughs> because it covers a lot of the horizontal space. That's normally not there. <laughs> uh, no, 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 no. I'm not talking about the bit. server. I'm talking about Yu-Gi-Oh in general. Common joke: Yu-Gi-Oh players can't oh, read. Nice. Like you just covered high. You just had covered high, low, and throw. <laughs> Bruh. You would just want item. <laughs> hey, oh, we got the loops. Hey, 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 hey. Fancy. First, though. I agree. Uh, but they're just uh, on the green. No. That's, <sighs> uh, I need to actually. That's such a simple and deadly setup that I, need, I should actually use that one. Oof. It's just uh. hard. Oh no, Ooh. we tried to go in. Oh, the trace. Literally, literally better than Ooh, brass. Overhead. That was really oh, good. and we kill the bird. Alright, now the real game begins. Overhead. Oh, tried to fuzzy block. Hey, Schmixy. Overhead. You didn't block. I was him expecting enough. cross. I was That's expecting fair. cross there. That's totally fair. Oh. Does Skull Girls have any. Hold that. Oh, we push block. I don't think we wanted to push yeah, block. Yeah, the, the uh, block stun lasts just like a frame longer than you think it does. No! Ah, we hey, jabbed. Hey. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, 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 it's I hate jail. jail. I love jail. Jail's the best. Whoa. That read. Oh, it came in. Oh, oh wait, and the that's snap. A bad... That was so smart. That was, that was a so bad. Smart, I'm going to I'm going to agree and say that that was a bad decision. No, no, that was a great decision. Did you see how much health they got back? Oh, yes, true. They did get a lot of health back. <laughs> Another in this. This is this is hard. But yeah, oh, they no. just oh, killed double nice anyway. Nice well, now they now bands in the corner. No, no, yeah, no, now that was a great hard. move. Hey, hey. Hey, hey. That's a low. Rip. Oh my god, oh, jab oh the grab. God. That was really good. Oh, oh yes, let's go. Let's good go. Shit, good, shit. good shit. Oh, that's my boy right there. That was pretty good. I, I didn't know how much uh, red health they have. How much yeah, did they have? Yeah, I didn't see their Dude, red they health. Got, they got like a <laughs> I was like, that's a pixel. Why insane. the hell did you leave me alive with a pixel there? <laughs> Dude, they got. Watch, watch back the VOD. They got an insane amount of health. Oh, okay. I, I okay, then shocked. I respect Never that. mind. I re Re I really good job, actually, they keep keeping I track rescind. of that. <laughs> yeah. I rescind. Uh, Nicely done. This matchup oh is this is probably the worst team for uh, Parasol to go against. I can't think of a worse team for Bear to fight. Uh, mine, that is. Uh, Honestly, though, I think Emigrant does worst... like nothing in this matchup because Bomber yeah. just smokes it. Yeah. Uh, the the evil really part about Peacock. MP. Is that she has amazing matchups against Zoners. <laughs> like Peacock against another Zoner is actually an amazing matchup for Peacock because she Robo deals with other characters one so the well. The Robo one is annoying until Peacock gets like an item held, and then it's yeah. like I don't care. <laughs> All right, so who have we got next? We're keep going. So we now have Billinos versus Trashy slash Random Rock. <laughs> Go in the lobby, please. Also, you do not get health back from snapping the dead body, but you do you do prevent Val from actually reviving her characters. 
uh, what do you call it? You can like, uh, it gets rid of the body. Yeah, that's such a uh, that's yes. such a clever game mechanic. <laughs> you can also snap assists. You can snap assists to get like half your red health back, right? Yeah. Yeah. There's so many just like cool, dumb little details in this game that I love. Like I love that all of the fights are a movie shoot because the the announcer at the beginning says. Uh, Ready, action! And at the end, he'll say, cut, 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 cut. And then if Beowulf's playing against Bella, he'll occasionally, when he's grabbing her, he'll be like, are you okay? And, like, he's double-checking. Yeah. It's all fake. It's, all, it's a movie shoot. They're, they're actors. Yeah. <laughs> well, it's actually dead. Yeah, turn. Unless you're playing Umbrella, then you're actually dead. This is true. They you say you're not absorbed. And die. There's, they say you're not dead, but you're eaten. <laughs> <laughs> My my absolute Never, favorite win line in the entire game is it's Peacock against Beowulf. She goes, I knew wrestling was real the whole time. <laughs> one, one, of, one of my oh. favorites with Bella versus Double, where Bella's just like, you do a killer impression. <laughs> uh, if you, anyone at home, if you ever just have like 10 minutes to waste and you like puns, uh, find your character's move list. All of the move uh, list names in this game are just the worst puns. You'll my ever. favorite lost line, my favorite lost line is Umbrella against Peacock. She'll, while she's crumpling, she'll say spamming is cheating. <laughs> <laughs> That's really good. Oh, it's the mirror match. We just have a different middle. Different mid. Oh god. Are you using Dartasis? Thanks so much for the follow, Uh I disagree with Dart Assist, uh, personally, because Dart Assist doesn't net you much versus oh M Shadow like this right here. Like, because yeah. M Shadow right here literally <laughs> nets you so much more. Um, Dart has little hit stun, and, and because yeah. Fuqua has all the scaling on most of her kit, Dart actually oh, scales no. the combo all the way oh, to 32%. Oh, no, this is so bad. So you don't want to. This wanna, is the struggle in the game. Oh, let nah, me drop it. Let me drop it, dude. Commentator curse, Doc Captain. Yeah. M Shadow, M Shadow oh, literally kind of solves neutral for you sometimes. So it's like, yeah. yeah. The other thing to consider too is that it covers the exact same space as the the fireball that you're using. Oftentimes, when you're thinking neutral assist, you want to also consider like, am I covering horizontal or vertical space here? And they cover the exact same amount of space, and you just get way more off M Shadow. You just oh, have hit. to be a little bit more active with the M Shadow calls and think a little bit more, but like the yeah. reward is infinitely greater. Yeah. Alright, come on. Yes, redeem me. Oh, nice? Oh, oh no, 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 no. I, that one's tough. That's hard, yeah. I'll be honest, I'm I have the way down. I don't like. know Beowulf's mid screen loop. Oh, oh blocks. I, I we, like we don't I think finish, they did that but... on purpose to save on Dizzy. I think that's actually smart. That's an if they intended call. to do that. That's like mad oh, sweaty, though. So you're losing points for that. Thanks so much for the follow, Preesh. Fireball, interesting idea. You do not want to wake up armor grab. No, you put yourself in a terrible situation. So if the you have the meter, armor, level, five, level, five, level five. Yeah, level five. Yeah, no! no oh, that would have worked. That would have worked if they did it right, yeah. Oh. That would have worked if they did it right, yeah. <laughs> You can get, I learned this, you can get level 5 after the timer. My hobby in this game yeah. is I try and figure out the maximum amount of time I can waste after the timer ends. You can <laughs> get level 5 after the timer ends. <laughs> true. You can, that's true. That's Fun fact, toxic. if you're if you're armor grabbing with Ugua and you have 3 meter, if they hit you, you can instantly level 3. So, if you want to put that into your game plan, I'm armor grab, I wake up, if they hit me, they get chomped. But you don't want to necessarily do that. That's a lot of meter. A, that's a lot of meter. B, that's hella risk. <laughs> it's like it's like almost like a threatening George, oh, but it's not as. Oh clean. no! <laughs> Wait, what? What happened? Why didn't they get snapped? Uh, they they, they, they snapped the, uh, the assist, flopped. but uh, the yeah. the point character flopped. Oh. oh no! We're pressing buttons all the way down. Rippy. Oh, we missed a few buttons. If we did all the buttons, I guess we would have been dead. No! In your strength! And he lives to see another day. With Pixel. Oh, oh back. back. Oh no, we didn't match back? Absolutely should have matched back. <laughs> oh, but the fireball, dude, the fireball! <laughs> 
Nah, if they sat in block, though, they would have died to chip. Better to go out like a man. That is a reversible. It's frame one invuln fully in the air and on the ground. Oh. Interesting. Ooh, that was that was ambiguous. Cross under, nice. What a match. Boy, on the <laughs> boy on the way down. Oh man. Oh, that's that was a bad time to tag. Oof. Watch out, she has a gun. Oh, oh no. We passed through double? <laughs> Game's great. Galea doesn't have a collision box, though, yeah. so it's okay. Skullgirls okay. is the best game because it avoids Why didn't we the spend trope the of fighting if game got... character with a fucking gun considered low tier. <laughs> <laughs> if you've got the bar to kill a character, absolutely take that chance. You do not need BFF in the corner. This is not a good use of your meter. That is a weird Jessica Cruz design. Hey, 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 hey. Uh, we dropped it. Uh, we're This is too sad. Dow G. Up, uh. Where's the Schmix? Schmix. Nice, we're mashing. Yeah, we're mashing. Uh, we're dropping. I wanted to go across a low. <laughs> what if your fireball touched my fireball? Yeah, we oh. absolutely were mashing drill on my gun. <laughs> like... Is drill not throwing vault? No. It's only strike and ball. Oh, interesting. Yeah, so you, can, yeah you, so you can you can mash grab if you want to. You can mash grab if you want to. <laughs> Leave your life bar behind. Leave her clones behind. <laughs> what if our fireballs clash? True. We dropped it. We're mashing. <laughs> Round start. I agree. Fireball. Okay. I was really hoping one of them would go point Fukua just for that matchup. Ooh. Ooh. How about we use a meter? This could be spicy. Ooh. Movement. No. That movement so though. Close. That was almost godlike. Yeah. Bilidos has had so many like almost snaps. I almost think it would be worth it to sit down and try and lab just weird conversions oh. into Grippy. snap. They both went for the group. It's a low unnecessary reset. <laughs> Finish your food. Interesting. Hey, hey. Oh, well, it was an American. That was hella American. No grippy. No setup. Oh. Do not commit to the grab. Just because you got the Elky doesn't mean you should commit to the grab. <laughs> that was projectile burst. That was weird. We didn't grip because she put out a hurt box. Like. <laughs> Got these? No. Oh, nah, unfortunate. Fireball, this. Yeah, flushed up with fireball is not a thing, by the way. Fireball? You actually just could have just came down with a button. Bridge. Bridge. Hey, hey. Home oh, goods. Bridge. Fireball? Gun, 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 gun. Fireball. I like the guns. Gun. gun. Use more gun. gun. Some more. Please, more gun. Good. Gun. Gun. More gun. Need more gun. There you go. Gun. More gun. Yes. More gun. Because Fuku can literally not do anything about this. Like. <laughs> gun. Oh, nice approach. Good. Nice, 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 nice. In the corner. Send a corner. Uh, hey. Don't with that tag. Grip. Hey. For the mixing, oh, we're dive kicking on the wake up. You gotta be careful. What? Hey, hey. I'm more surprised she got out of there alive. Oh, Ripperoni. Still mashing. Still mashing. We have learned. Why did we destruction <laughs> pillar? Why did you commit to car? You Why saw that they that were work? blocking. You saw that they were blocking. This is a horrible mistake. Oh, this hey. is so. Sad. You're dead. Never mind. Oh, you dropped. Done. You should not be committing to gum against any. Any can uh, army for full any. screen. Not against any. Yeah, 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 yeah. There it is. No. Yeah. That was that was the uh, yeah. quintessential three zero. It was close though. Yeah. <laughs> we didn't. We should not have committed to. Any to is why there. we can't have nice things. Yeah. Full screen. Full screen arm, dude. 
<laughs> I think how I think you can tell how good a character is in this game by how bad their backstory, like how awful to have lived their backstory Cat is, Cat <laughs> like how sad not, their backstory is. Your, Cat heads is not your answer. Car is your answer. <laughs> but if you want a car in, in the thing before, yes, Cat heads. I, I, I totally believe. Understandable. Holy heck. Okay, now we've got Sheet versus Will. Everyone a Dash Crescent. Uh, do, uh, what do you call it? Dash Macro? Or uh, what do you call it? Uh, button Dash. Yeah. I've been trying to incorporate Button Dash into my Big Bam play a lot more, so that it opens up, you know, approaching parries better. Uh, it's definitely worth learning, in my opinion. Beep. Beep versus? What's up, Dave? You missed your thing. It's your ting. Oh, you obviously not understandable. That's totally fair. So we got sheep. You, you on will. overslept. It's 9 p.m. <laughs> when did you go to bed? All right. <laughs> you overslept. Aren't you about to go to bed again? Like <laughs> <laughs> Just on that night shift grind set? <laughs> Oh, please don't talk about Night of Near Me. It triggers me. <laughs> no. <laughs> Four years, Doc. Oh, oh God. No. That's to See, there are certain... You sacrifice things with every job. Sleep is the one thing I refuse to sacrifice. I will not take a night shift. I cannot with sleep third during shift? the Oof, night dude. anymore. Oh, my God. I am inherently nocturnal at this point. Oh, that sucks, dude. That yeah, sucks. Third shift, yeah, that's the case. Will, where are you at? Oh, I just wanted to give what your match doing, to someone Willis? else. Give your match to someone else here. Give you like two minutes. And to go to can't wait to go to combo breaker. I, I won't be able to go this year. Almost, although I think yes, I have money now. That is right. I do have. You could money. go to Combo Breaker. I could, in theory. Only you just need theory. to find a room with someone. Yeah, that's not going to be possible. <laughs> <laughs> not, not this late. Yeah, I, I like to imagine that there's some like poor businessman who needs to get a hotel <laughs> that, that weekend for some reason. Right. Like, why the fuck can I not get a room? In? Oof. Uh, you, you missed your GG set. I'm not going to be doing advanced advancement sets tonight because it's been a, it's been quite it's a day. <laughs> it's, it's, as I said earlier, it's 9 p.m. Uh, yeah. they could probably get get in here against sheep though. Good. Or if you want to play against sheep, hard card against sheep. Actually, <laughs> it's more yeah. once like versus, versus cards a little better. Okay, but sheep saying they want to play me, so I guess we'll play. Do you want me to... Oh, shit. Hold on. My Steam Deck just fell. <laughs> That's right. JP is a Steam Deck gamer now. <laughs> Steam Deck exclusive. What an I absolute wish. nerd he is. <laughs> I think it's a link. This whole <laughs> conversation <laughs> has been... How does it run? Deck. Does it get hot? Uh, not any hotter than, like, your PC, really. It's, it's Do fine. you own a Switch to compare? I I owned a Switch, yes. Oh, what, what made you move away console. from the Switch? Uh, I didn't. It, well, it's not by my choice. But <laughs> oh, oh. Uh, <laughs> we won't get into that. Then. <laughs> she took the Switch. <laughs> <laughs> what about the kids? She took the Switch. <laughs> it was for the, the Switch was for yeah. the kids. I mean, <laughs> uh, it kind of it makes sense when I think about it, but it still hurts. <laughs> Chief, do you want me to play my actual team or like? I don't even know. <laughs> play whatever the fuck? I don't know. Am I playing my real team? Am I real teaming it? Use violence. Am I using my violence? <laughs> What's your guys' opinion on holding back against beginners? Yes. Uh, yeah, you absolutely should. 
I yeah, I don't <laughs> I don't think you're obligated to do it, but I think it's a good idea to do it. Okay. I know a lot of beginners, they're like, don't I, hold back on me, man. Just go all out. Respect. They say that, that but respect. I don't want to destroy hopes and dreams. So like, <laughs> yeah. yeah, exactly. Well, it's, not, it's not even that. Like, if, if I want, if my goal is for you to like this game and continue playing, you're not going to be able to just understand what is happening on the screen. Yeah, this game's exactly. way if, too fast. <laughs> yeah, if so they I tell me not to, if they're like a beginner, what I'm going to do is I'm going to pick like the two characters yes. that give Peacock the craziest mix and then i'm just gonna go for the stupid mix you know what i mean mm -hmm. be like all right I don't, I don't care if you block this i don't care if i win i just want to make you be like whoa that's so cool that was a wild wake up gun good pbgc didn't commit Up. That's why I do that. That's so unfortunate. But also really funny. Nice. Like. L bomber? Yes. Good rush. Good call. Okay. Some very smart defensive play from Sheep. Uh, got a little aggressive there near the end and Is, like the no, middle. No, things fine. <laughs> Super. Uh, I'm just talking about like the umbrella. The the umbrella match was pretty bad. Red rock. Uh. Later, Yin. Makes me some purple. That is such a good color. I'll hold my piece. Listen, most of the purples in this game are pretty bad, but this one's kind of godlike. I guess I'm not just... Uh, I'm just not that heavy on purple. Based on just what you know right now, Baghdad, what would you say is the correct umbrella assist? Uh... I don't know. Probably Wishmaker still... Yeah, I've been I've been seeing the DP a lot, and I uh, you know that's solid. I don't but... think the DP is the way. Yeah, the DP I'm, is... I'm not 100 percent on it. I don't think the DP is that. Ooh, ooh, icky connection there. Oh, that's right. So JP, in the future, you want to avoid this situation happening. Uh, just so you know. <laughs> I agree. I agree. I agree. Or only the best advice here. Get great. Is Umbi DP hunger variable? Uh, yes, it is. Oh, yeah, Salt Grinder is also like a really good assist. True. If salt you Grinder is insane. Does so much damage. Yeah, if you want the max amount of damage plus meter gain, it's still, you use Salt Grinder. Yeah. Um. Uh, 6 HP is interesting. It has a lot of funny uses with Peacock. I don't think anyone else gets anything from it, though. <laughs> I don't think so either, actually. Uh, Big Ban. I, I know Big Ban can use it in the corner to do some pretty Boko damage. Uh, he can I actually get the Boko stagger into his, uh, what do you call it? l and then get a follow-up off that. Ooh, almost. 
Almost funny damage. <laughs> Uh, that routing is immaculate. JP's a beast. <laughs> nice. Oh no. He's oh, got the bull. Oh, oh. That was really weird the way it's just happened. You know, you don't want to be The drill kind of messed me up there. Yeah. Oh, gross. These bubbles are disgusting. Yeah, these are especially icky bubbles. That's urine. <laughs> that is not urine. It's green. That is absolutely it's urine. Gr are it's you colorblind? It's, it's green. Gross, dude. <laughs> urine in a dirty toilet. I was I was thinking more like sewage water or or like a swamp sort of situation. It's disgusting. That's what it is. I mean, I I, I agree with you there. It is very icky looking. Liam, please fix. <laughs> Liam, this is, please. This this, this takes priority this over balancing umbrellas. <laughs> GG. Fix that, let Beowulf step on it, the game will be <laughs> <good then. laughs> <It's God>. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god. Uh, for the most part there, it's it's hard, because, you know, Double Fuku is just an extremely good shell, so like I can cover a bunch of options at the round start. Uh, you, you kind of committed too hard to the jumping heavy punch round start, or just like up forwarding into a button. Um, which was worked the first time and then never again because yeah, heck and drill plus crouch heavy punch into HL covers literally almost everything. So it's like it's it's hard otherwise. You kind of have to either respect it or try to get in, like get in with normal plus assist. Since you also one, have uh, your own gun, so you can just true. back off. You could also just gun me too. That is also yeah. an option. <laughs> so. Uh, it's not not like she isn't prone to just you know, what if your gun touches my gun? Okay, well we're back at neutrals, and then it's just down to assists. Then whose assist is better? And so then, kind of play that out, and just do that kind of RPS for a little bit. Um, I love RPS. <laughs> Bail player over here. I like rock paper scissors, but it's only rock and scissors, and then the rock is the moe head, and you're directly above me. You have to choose what size. <laughs> I'm actually a beast at RPS IRL though. My 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 be my my childhood best friend refuses to play me because I'd always beat him. Here they. I'm not gonna lie, Doc. You sound like the kind of guy that'd be like, "Uh, I do Spock. Spock beats Rock." With no, 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 no. That's no fun. That's, that's lame. Well, I, do, I do gun. Gun beats Spock with a no. bullet. That's lame. That's oh, lame. God. That's pretty lame. Like, oh man. Um, I missed my set. You, if you want to still play, you can play against Card. Like that's the thing. It is an open lobby at the end. It's an open lobby. Yeah, Card Alm is still common. Did you guys know that's his actual name, by the way, Card I did that, know that. I'm glad to learn. That is quite the name. It's also a lie. I made it it's up. Just, it's just. Quite it's just name. like. Did you know that Squiggly did, yeah. is can canonically short for Squidward? <laughs> <laughs> you can look that up. Would you? Would you? I it's never real. wanted that. Because I lied to you, again. wouldn't mean you would lie to me, right? Oh yeah, no, 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 no. I would never lie to you. That's the, that's the truth. Oh, even Lord. even if hidden variable may disagree with me, that's the truth. <laughs> oh god. By the way, we are. Uh, uh, Ruby, if you want to host it, sure, but it's 9 p.m. It's it where is... I'm up past my bedtime. <laughs> Uh, advanced testing is not a thing tonight because it's been quite the day for me, so it definitely will have to be next week. <laughs> Aren't you already advanced, Ruby? <laughs> yes. Well, I, think he needs to I, I think he needs to try it again. Yeah, he needs to renew. <laughs> Re Ruby needs a renewal. <laughs> You've you fallen off recently, Ruby. Uh, <laughs> not ironically. Uh, uh, we, need, we need to retest to make sure you're still in snuff. <laughs> yeah, for the people. Not not for the people. Not Not today. Next weekend for sure. This is the DMV. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Baghdad, where are you at in life? Are you school, job, high school? Uh, 
I've definitely asked you this before, but I've forgotten. Training, I guess you could say. Training? Okay, okay. What are you training for? Uh, stuff. Fair. <laughs> Things. Awfully Absolutely specific, aren't you? Absolutely fair. Absolutely uh, I, I don't like talking about it. I totally valid, understand. Valid. I'm is it like, not is it like an interesting person, but I also valid. don't like talking about my life. Is it like totally embarrassing, understand. don't want to talk about it, or... Like you, if you told me you'd have to kill me, don't want to talk about it. <laughs> I could tell you, but that I have to kill you. <laughs> yeah, I mean, we just think about it. Us, us fighting game players yeah. die multiple times every day. What a, so. what a DP! What that just was, happened? That was so good. Like, <laughs> did you see that? <laughs> Whoa, uh. By the way, I taught cart that one, so now y'all have to be scared. <laughs> Yeah, a, a, a talk cart that schmixy. <laughs> he, he has definitely upped his schmix recently. He has definitely done less jump light punch into 2LK mix. True, true. There's, there's much less of that. Oh, you're dead. Oh, you're so dead. You are Too incredibly bomb. dead. Look at that top three character, by the way. <laughs> top three. Oh. They respawn. <laughs> I wonder if Sage knows that his tier list has inspired so much infamy. Probably not. <laughs> <laughs> he probably just made that shit half thinking. I was like, yeah, so this is a job well done. <laughs> We've been grappling with it for the last week. <laughs> it took a bite of my cake and it's over. I'm yeah, memeing on yeah, it. Dude. What are you talking about? I'm not grappling <laughs> with it. I know it's Cap. Yeah. Your tier list is your tier list of tier list is really good. Yes. Yo, your <laughs> tier list whack. My tier list my factual. Tier list. Yeah, I, I have the only factual I, I have made the only factual tier list in this community, the has met Santa tier list. The projectile tier list. I don't know, Rat Baby's Taco Bell tier list was pretty dope. Pretty solid. <laughs> they could pretty they solid. should absolutely bring back that grilled burrito dude. They, need, they, they need, brought it back for a little while. They brought it back for like a month and now it's gone again. They need to bring back the Quesarito. That's my favorite the thing. It, it's like it's kind of back. It's only online, but none of the shops near me do yeah. do the online orders. And plus I hate their apps, so what is it? The way to play this, you do not want to be tossing out double Clyde like that to Willy Nilly because we got beat extent. The Taco uh, so Bell near where I live, actually, I say near where I lived, it's like 45 minutes away. Uh, they actually the added Bell. a stealth checkout. Oh, Fast this is an interesting option. Valid. Uh, unfortunately, yeah, you can't really convert at that angle. Uh, you can with a well-timed, uh, well-timed and well-spaced LB. Oh no, actually. oh no, yeah. do not commit to super afterwards, no. You need, you need to get them like behind you to get the real conversion. Maybe you could do it with like LK, but that just jump. screws up that's the combo. That's actually kind of cool. Dash up crap. Cart, cart, you know this. Do not end your block strings with heavy moves because they are super premiumly unsafe. Rippy mix. Hey, hey, Schmixy. Cross. Oh, nice. Yeah. Good block. I got hit. Oh, yeah. Block some. Boosh. Bang! Do it hey, again. What a dash, dude! <sighs> Man, this spell is very clean. Hey, 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 hey. Hey, nice. Watch your noggin. Hey, 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 hey. Yeah, you're dead. Ow. One and one? Yeah. This is kind of rough. Tay, Tay just hasn't been able to play. This is. Yeah, Tay, try not getting hit. <laughs> For what it's worth, more defensive options. Oof. You have a gun! Chill out! <laughs> Back off! Last. It's just mass DP assist nonstop. Uh, you don't know, if you uh, see the cat, reach for if, the gat. If, <laughs> if you're having trouble with the, the assist on the but opposing side. the cat side, just runs under just... the cat. What are you talking about? True. <laughs> Group. You, you if, have options to cover that. If you're having trouble with the DP assist on the opponent's side, you just touch the assist so it's more on, more on lockout than it is. Mm -hmm. Actually, gamers, I'm going to gonna bail a little bit early tonight. Y'all be easy. No worries. Uh, wait until we're in the game before you leave so the lobby doesn't explode. We'll do True. it. He did it early. He broke it. I bet. I, I, bet. I totally bet. Oh, now we're going for me to extend? I guess. 
Oh, uh, with a grip. That's a reset on the way down. Yeah. No confirm with DP assist? No pick. Ooh, you should oh, not be calling your assist like that. That was bad. That was, bad as, that was a bad call. Hey. Uh. Hey. 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 Hey, hey. Cart, you should learn the funny one that Katsu does on bands. Oh, oh. Tay has given up. Oh. Yeah. That sucks. It's just. What a smear. Whatever. Oh, Tay, come on, man. Don't beat yourself up like that. It's just a bell band game. It's like one step below or above a Bayo band game, come on, man. <laughs> game, game, come. <clears throat> Uh, excellent play from Cart. Uh, lots Ooh. more variety in your mix. Uh, you weren't as afraid to approach as you have been in the past. Um, pretty good. Just been keeping way with it. way better assist calls too. You're not just really? throwing it out. You're not just the down back plus assist. Uh, on defense, not good. Oh, Tay, come on, man. Are better than you give yourself credit for. Like you just woke up. A, you just woke up, so you're probably not even warmed up. So then it's like, there's there's factors. You are a good player. Uh to sheep. There, there's no advance this week. There'll be advance next week because it's been quite a day. But uh, I would like to thank you all for coming out to this dang old stream at super late at night. Appreciate y'all. I expect that for thanks help. For, yeah, thanks for dragging me in here. I'm happy to help. Uh, I feel like I didn't commentate enough, but at the same time, I don't really feel like I should. <laughs> commentated a lot, actually. Run Did it I? back. I don't know. We'll see how much you actually said. <laughs> you said a lot. Okay, I guess. <laughs> uh, th yeah, thanks for having me on, JP. It was a lot of fun. Yeah. Uh, yeah, it's Thanks like, everyone it's for coming out. Yeah, thank you Maybe coming next out. time I should actually take place in one of the. Sure. Be cool. All right. Like Catch stream. you all later. Break that preach. Goodbye. If you'd like to see more Skullgirls from us, always Skullgirls B great every Wednesday at 8 p.m. EST. Hop into that. You come to get great, then you go be great. Join our Dangle tournament on Wednesdays. It'd be great. We'll see you all next time. Reesh. Later, everybody.